And it's working. Wait, except my timer. Gotta refresh for the timer to work. Good morning, everyone. Cabo here. It is Saturday morning. I uh, got out of work early, which means there's a chance to stream in the day. And I still need to finish the, uh, well, the chapter two intermission. And I still need to start up chapter three. And last time we ended up finishing the, uh, the main story for chapter two and we entered a new area, which is called Luminous Square. So when I entered this area, I thought that there were like a couple of problems with my PC in terms of like the, uh, what should call it, the performance. But apparently it's like a normal thing. Uh, apparently this place isn't very optimized and it's probably from the fact that there's like this. Like a bunch of like NPCs like walking around and maybe they haven't like uh, worked out on uh, the performance and it's taking too much of the, the game's own performance rather than taking, uh, well, using the uh, resources from your PC correctly or from like your phone correctly and it's causing this like very weird lag that is uh you can sometimes see when you're looking towards like the middle of the area uh of course there's like no lag if i'm looking at the at the floor like i did it like there you can see a little bit of like a it's a little bit choppy let's say but uh yeah uh i'm gonna work out on the um actually finish up the uh the story missions because i actually got really excited at the end of chapter two like that whole mecha thingy of just like say the name of the prototype in order to give it power and call it just like pulling on all, all the strength just saying insane trying to fight the uh the unknown ethereal or like the unidentified ethereal still don't have a name for that if i remember correctly i will probably get a name for it uh once i start this like quest because the i'm supposed to be going to the public security office and check out what's going on with that uh with like that un unidentified ethereal because the uh, the public security office grabbed the body and the parts of the uh the other mechs and they're like checking it out uh over there just like doing some tests or whatever i'm actually not even sure but uh yeah this new area looks really good if i remember correctly from info that i uh i found out about the beta of this game i don't think this part of the map was unlocked and there's like a lot there's like new stuff there's like the new stand over here and there's no dog over there there's like a, a public security officer with like officer bang boost i did see a couple of things from like the uh from the update program from the 1.1 update program i didn't actually watch it and i didn't spoil myself for like anything i just saw like what event and what uh like new things were going to be adding and this like little bangboo right here the the police officer bangboo is apparently going to get added to the uh to the pool of the other bangboos here so it's just going to be added to this one it's probably going to be like right here or something um i did see like the new character and i saw that a lot of people are very excited for her because uh, she just got power crept. <laughs> if you know what I mean. If you know, you know. <laughs> Seriously, they animated that. I can't believe that they actually worked to actually to animate that. Uh, I was very, I was very surprised when I saw it. I saw it and it's just like, wait. Uh, well, because when I'm at work, I usually don't do. I'm not doing like a lot of things, and I'm just looking at a. Uh, I'm just trying to find things to do. So I do have Reddit and I usually just like scroll through with it. I'm not too into it, but like uh, looking at uh, information on like Reddit and stuff like that. Oftentimes I just like see what's going on and I see some memes and I get a laugh or something uh, while well, there's like nothing to do at work. And one of the things that were supposed to be like on the, uh, on the hot page uh, was her walking animation. It's just like, oh wait, that's, that's kind of cool. It's just like there and people are excited for her. And then I look at the comments and it's just like, ah, ah, that's why they're excited for her. They're excited for the horny. Let's just say that. That's, that's the reason why everyone's excited for her. <laughs> she does look like a good character though. Both of the character, the new characters, uh, one of them is like on the cute side, and the other one is like on the uh, on the dangerous Jandere side. Or at the very least, that's what the uh, her image gives. Uh, the, what what that's what I can see from like her image, but I don't actually know if she's gonna be Jandere or if she's gonna be calm or if she's gonna be an Oness sometime. I actually have absolutely no idea. We'll see when we meet her, but I'm not sure when we're gonna meet her. We might meet her on chapter three or at the start or maybe at the end i don't know what her affiliation is i know that the first character uh, i think her name is shi king or shi Jing, or something like that uh i from like the clothes that she has i'm pretty sure that her affiliation is the public security because she looks very much like her 
for like the clothes that she's wearing. Um, but we'll see that. I'll probably get a lot of information the moment that I continue with like the story. But anyways, uh, let's start because I really need to unlock this. This and I think there's one more somewhere around here. Or I did see this. And I was very, very scared because I thought this event was actually this event. And this event is some sort of like daily event where you need to go to the spot uh, where this girl is like promoting uh, the this like little shop of the bank booze, the general shop. And it's not the general shop. I don't know what it's called. One for one convenience store or something like that. Uh, but yeah, she's promoting it and you go towards her and you give her some stuff and she gives you well the, all these things uh, at random. Uh, so I thought that this was this event and because this event only has one day left i thought it got screwed over because this is daily so you need at the very least five days in order to get the big prize uh that was like on the bottom right which is like i don't know 70 currency and a bunch of like other stuff but uh yeah i thought it was crude but uh no i actually got lucky i also gotta finish this one but this one i can complete tomorrow uh, off stream and there's another one i'm pretty sure yeah this one watch your step one day in 14 hours and i need a level 30 and main story chapter 2 interlude uh interlude intermission and well of course i'm already level 30 i'm about to hit a level 40 uh i'm very very close to hitting level 40 so yeah i just need to finish the story and also another thing is just like on the battle pass on the season task one of the uh the things that you have to do is complete main story chapter three in order to get 1.6k of the rewards and i really need it because i'm lagging behind i'm really 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 lagging behind i only have three levels of, i'm gonna have to buy a level Ooh. season ends in eight days yeah i might need to buy a level yeah, i might be one level short because this is like the max oh i'm barely off Am I? I'm actually not sure. No, 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 no. I'm still I'm still very far from actually getting the levels to finish the battle pass. So I only have three levels left for this week, which is gonna land me at 39. And then on next week, I'm gonna uh, only be having 10 levels max because of the weekly XP limit, which is gonna leave me at 49. And that's what sucks. Uh, yeah, I'm probably going to have to buy this last level, but there's no problem because on the last level I get this, which is 680. I'm probably going to buy the battle pass, by the way. Uh, I get this, and pretty much I don't lose much. I lose 150, which would mean that I only end up gaining 530 of these things, the polychromes. Yeah. All right, and I also grabbed... Sit. This, the redemption code, uh, which gives me 300. And this is 100 very nice because uh, I'm going to be using half of it to gain that last level. Right? Anyways, on to the story. Uh, Luminia branch of the public security at your service. Citizens, road tie parking is prohibited on this street. Uh, on this street. Violators would be fined. Hello. Um, please follow traffic laws and use crossings when crossing the street. The safety of the city depends on everyone's cooperation. The Janus Quarter Public Security Headquarters is carrying out our Public Security Safety Awareness Month events throughout the whole district. Hi, I need some help! Citizens are certainly invited to join. For more details about the event, please say 1 for self-service payment or fines. Or fines. Please say 2 for bank booth self-service. Please say 9. Whoa, we just get a lot of numbers there. 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 Dear citizen, are you calling me? What do you need? Uh, what a terrible system. Yeah, seriously. You're looking for a nearby parking lot? Understood. Querying. Vacant parking space is currently in Lumina Square 0. Distance to the nearest currently available parking space 2.1 kilometers. Thanks, got it. You're welcome. The IT department of the Lumina branch sincerely invites you to raid our bank booth self-service system. Good job. Next time, I hope I can avoid it. <laughs> yeah, next time, I hope that I don't have to use it. Yeah, I do hate those sort of like systems that are actually just like automated when you're just starting to talk to someone. I can only imagine like the future when they're uh, more like the uh, the AI things are just like, I don't know, they like evolve. And you know how there's like some convenience stores or not convenience stores, but like, restaurants. I thought there would be a chef back here. That sucks. Uh, what's he saying? All oh, right. Uh, you know how some 
fast food restaurants are using like those little robot thingies to actually like, walk around and take orders and bring the orders to like the uh to the tables uh, i can only imagine there being like a bunch of problems of this kind whenever that becomes a little bit more popular so yeah yeah also, this is like the new newspaper stand, and instead of like an old dog, there's an old lady. Which is fine, I guess. The dog is cute. Howl is cute. This game looks really nice. Ooh. I don't know what that thing is called, but it's there. Alright. Uh, a ah, human! I can actually ask this person and not get shut down by like the uh, the automatic service. Is he going public security officer? Ooh, busted again. Illegal parking in an alleyway. If a crime happens but nobody witnesses it, does it cease to be a crime? Being a crime? Moreover, nothing can escape these eyes of mine, for I am this starlight knight. <laughs> uh, hi. Every fine is meant to protect, and this is my duty. Take this. I was originally considering leaving the car here, but it looks like it will be slapped with a ticket by this officer soon. It's better not to take the risk. Oh, I'm not gonna ask her? What are we gonna be doing then? Where am I gonna park the car? I mean, the bank boot told me that there's like a parking spot, but that's like two kilometers away. That's pretty far. That's a lot of walking. It'd be like taking an Uber back over here and actually going to the public security office. Does Bell have any idea? Nice, you're back. How's everything? Uh, the nearest parking lot is two kilometers away. Really? I just checked on my phone and it got pretty much the same result. Two kilometers. I guess we'll just have to settle for that. Oh, really? I guess they're not lazy. Like me. Actually, no. I'm not that lazy of a person on parking spaces. If I can get a good parking spot with like shadow and like no cars around me, and even if it's far, I'll take it. Because, uh, yeah, I don't like uh, when other cars park next to me, especially when it's one of those like, hmm. Um, but you're not parking from the side, you're parking from like the front. Uh, because a lot of times cars can end up parking really close to you. And when they open the door, they're a bunch of little annoying little pricks. And they end up hitting your car. And, and yeah, it's really bad when that happens. Especially when they got kids. Because kids just slam doors. They just push the doors. Uh, with like all their strength. Because they, they know, don't know much, uh, much better. Like because they would really want to get out of the car. I don't know if they're going to like eat or something like that. And they're like excited and they just like slam or not slam. Well, yeah, they slam the door on your car. But yeah, there's like not much to do about that other than just like get hit. Because most of the time you're not going to be there when it happens. Especially if you're there, you can just like give them the side eye and they'll, they'll just be scared. Or they'll like be more careful about what they're doing. But if you're not there, then they can just do whatever the hell they want. And uh, it's, yeah, it's just like, usually I don't notice small things like that. So yeah, usually a problem. Uh, then let's get going. To the parking lot. Mm, but they, they said that the, they didn't want to take the metro because it's always like <laughs> loaded or uh, like the station or something like that so i forgot to check out the parking in advance there's a little longer bell <laughs> Mm -hmm. This is usually what I think when I have uh when I pick a, a parking spot that's very far away from where I'm going. Eh? <laughs> but I'm not the one that's complaining, right? Mm, that's right. On the chapter one intermission, the only thing that they had was ramen. Ramen's good. And it's not instant ramen. It's ramen from like a store. I wish I could eat one of those. Those things look, look delicious. Mm, I knew you were complaining for a reason. Haha. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> it's so cute. I don't know what's wrong with Kitty. Kitty just keeps walking back and forward. I don't know if she wants to be here with me or if she's like looking for something else. I checked her litter box and it should be clean. It should be clean. Hmm. Yeah, I wanted to choose this option instead of the other one because the other one might feel a little... It's like a tease, but just in case, just in case instead of it being a tease, it ends up being something like uh, making her feel guilty about picking something. I know that she's very easygoing, but I, I just, I'm just kind of afraid. I don't want to be mean to her. <laughs> oh, cutscene. Whoa! Oh my... Hey, it's a new character! And it's the current character! <laughs> Have we? Ah. Oh, it's because we're criminals, right? That's right, that's right. <laughs> we probably know about them because we're criminals. There we go, chapter 2 interlude. Mission Unthinkable. Did this show on the cha on chapter 1? As an interlude? But yeah, that's crazy. That car was going on the sidewalk. Also, the moment that... that that the time stopped on the cutscene, I thought, uh, oh, is this gonna be it? Is this gonna be like the, the part that's gonna make me sad about the game that the other person was talking about? I seriously have no idea what it might be. Who knows? It might have been like the end of chapter two with the uh, the thing with the prototype. I still don't know what the name of the prototype is. They only mentioned it once and I'm terrible with names, so I can never remember it. But uh, I don't know if it was that part that was supposed to be sad or if there's something that's gonna happen on chapter three. It's gonna make... Uh, it's gonna feel like pretty bad to the point that'll make me cry. I mean, I cry to everything, so yeah, I'm probably gonna cry anyways, even if it's something very like small and simple. Suyen, Shingi. <laughs> yeah, uh, with a lot of broken bones. That car was going really damn fast. I can't wait to actually see more of this character because at first I thought that I wasn't going to be very interested about it. But uh, like I mentioned before, from like the videos, the promotional videos that she had, uh, I really started loving her. Like really, really liking her character because she's like, Whenever she's like, on, she has like her work mode and she has like her, like, you know, her normal casual mode. And in her casual mode, she's more of like a, she's like shy and stuff like that. She doesn't like, well, she it's not that she doesn't like cats, but she's afraid of cats. She's also pretty cute. Like on the, on the first like trailer that they showed of her, the animated trailer. Mm, she's afraid of cats and she wasn't doing well of like uh, filming that promotional dinghy. I don't know if it was a promotional video. Or like a movie or a promotional video for the public security because you know usually police uh and things like that do like promotional videos i think i actually haven't seen one in a very long time probably because i don't look at the tv i'm usually just stuck on the internet i never look at cable uh yeah and there's also like on the other one on the other animated video that she had uh she was like at home and it was like her weekend and she was talking to like her family and stuff like that. And she started feeling really bad because she hadn't seen her family uh, for a long time. And she had postponed seeing them uh, multiple times. And finally she decided, you know what? Screw it. I'm not going to be doing work this weekend and I'm going to go see my family. And I thought that was so sweet. That was so, so, so sweet. And I just like, I don't know, that that single trailer just like grabbed my heart. And it made me like her so much. Because it's just like. As someone that has gone away from home and lives somewhere very, very far. 
What do you want, kitty? Mira. I don't know why. Usually she just starts looking at me and until I say her name. It's like me giving her permission to get closer to me. I say her name and she walks closer and she starts like laying uh, either on my feet or under my seat. But yeah, now she's under the seat. Just scratching her scratching her chin. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, someone did that uh, that has to live far away from like her, his only like family or like close family member. Oh, hey, Leviathan. How's it going? <laughs> How you doing? How's your morning, afternoon, night, depending on your time zone? I'm just like petting my kitty right now because she wants some love. So I'm just giving her some love. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Mm, I don't remember the cause of the accident. That's great. That's good to hear. It's always nice to hear that somebody's uh, day is going well. Mine is going well as well. I ended uh, work early, so now I'm just doing some streaming. Uh, because I gotta finish this uh, this mission. This like chapter, chapter 2 intermission. Run up CCC myself for dailies. Really? How far are you into CCC? Have you finished like the whole main story? Did you actually watch like the... Uh, what you call it, the stream or the video today? When was it? Like a couple of hours ago? Five, six hours ago? Oh, mission one, so you haven't done much, like at all. You're still in like chapter one. By the way, this is, uh, this is chapter two, intermission. So if you, uh, I don't know if you are trying to like be careful about like spoilers or stuff like that but yeah this is like uh this is probably gonna be like a lot of spoilers it is barely like the start of it so it's nothing has happened of importance but uh yeah if you're like being careful about spoilers and yeah uh you should probably just uh i don't know close your eyes <laughs> i'm giving you views spoilers with that <laughs> thank you Leviathan. <laughs> that's actually super nice of you Especially because not too long ago I managed to uh to finally hit over 50 followers. So now I can start working on affiliate. But I'm thinking of only starting to actually fully work on getting affiliate after I've got my my true model. Uh so far, uh right now I just commissioned an artist to do my OC, to draw my OC, which should be done by like um uh, when did you say it would be done? August, September? Probably around September or the start of like October. But uh, yeah, after that, then I'm going to start working on like model on commissioning someone for model art. And after that, some rigging. So I'm pretty excited about that. And after that, I'll probably start thinking about maybe hit, trying to hit affiliate. But for now, I'm just like chilling, just like uh, taking this uh, as a very hobby kind of thing, you know? She said way more things than there are on like this dialogue box here. And I also didn't expect her to be this kind of character. Uh, I expected her to be more of like a carefree character. Uh, a, I don't know. Mm, you know how in a lot, a lot of animes there's like this like teenage character, all of this like lovely characters that are actually like very very energetic and they like like sweets and stuff like that. I expected her to be this sort of like character, but instead of that, she's giving me she's giving off the uh, young, but at heart or like in her, her mind she's like very very old, especially with the way that she's speaking. She's speaking like somebody from that's like I don't know eighty years old, something that. that got teleported to the present from like the past or something like that that's the uh, sort of like vibe that she's giving me oh is this what they're gonna teach me where i'm gonna be resting in this area because i'm supposed to go to the public security office i think it's him for your help <laughs> ah yes plug in the video store 
<laughs> you do that a lot inside missions, just plugging in the video store to people around and just like telling them, hey, we have a disc on, on our membership card for this month, if you want to take it. <laughs> because they're having a tough, uh, tough time with like their money. Uh, I was thinking of something. Oh, right. I was going to ask you, Leviathan. Have you been gushing on this game or are you just playing it uh, just leisurely? Well, I'm going to guess that you're playing it very, very leisurely since you're not like caught up on like the story and you're only on like chapter one. And I'm pretty sure that on chapter one, you don't even have dailies unlocked. It takes a long while to get the like, dailies unlocked. Oh, wait. You said that you're doing missions. Yeah, it's probably the normal missions, I'm guessing. Story missions. Mm. If you're a fan of anime, then this is like the perfect uh, comparison that I can give of Shinji. It's to Frieden. I'm not the target audience of Gacha Game. Ah. Are you perhaps playing it because of it being like an action game? I play on stream and don't pay money for gacha. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I understand it. It's very understandable. It's also not bad because usually when you start like uh, swiping, it's like no going back. The next time that you want a character is going to feel so much easier to swipe because you did it before. And that's when you start running out of money. <laughs> I don't usually uh, swipe much on like uh, gacha games either i usually only grab the monthly and maybe the battle pass depending on how committed i am to the game and since i've heard a lot of good things about the like the company that makes these games like uh you know uh honkai impact genshin honkai star rail and now zzz um i've heard good things about the company and i also played quite a bit of like honkai impact so and it's a good game so i'm kind of like a little bit more committed from the start when usually i'd wait for i don't know a month or two months uh to see if i'm gonna like you know swipe or use money on the game and so far i'm just thinking of doing the same thing that i've done with the other games it's just like uh pay for the monthly and grab the battle pass and that's about it since they're both like not very expensive <laughs> Ah, because she gives off the idea of uh, actually going over there to check us out as if like we're doing something illegal, uh, even though we are actually doing something illegal. <laughs> we're proxies. <laughs> or maybe something happened. We're on 6th Street. Public Safety Awareness Month questionnaire. Oh, right. The bank will mention this. A letter from Officer Suijan. Su Yun. Zhu Yun. I'm actually not sure how to pronounce this. It appears to be a survey for an upcoming public event hosted by the public security. Hmm, doesn't this person on the front look familiar? Not to me. Not to me at all. Sex about him. See, not like the chief. Deputy commander. Hmm. Alright, I did ask about like the uh, the gacha games, but uh uh and stuff like that, but is there perhaps like any character that you looked at that has caught your attention? That you might want to like pull for using like your free stuff of course not actually like swiping uh i know that they're on these games or like uh for games from like hoyoverse they end up doing a bunch of like reruns so even if you don't get them on like their first like banner let's say there's usually a chance to get them later uh unless unless another character ends up catching your attention and you end up pulling for them and then by the time the, the other character gets a rerun then you're just like out of uh, cash monies polychromes as they call it in this game Ooh, her that's nice i still have i still haven't tried her her like combat demo but you got Ben bigger, and I'm happy because it's Ben big. <laughs> That's a big pull. I actually went for Ellen myself. I really like the uh, the whole uh, the jagged teeth. I really like that on like characters. That and of course you're supposed to be like the maid. Ben rolls. 
oh, I can't wait until you see him on the uh, on the story. You're gonna be surprised because Ben is quite a character. He's actually. <sighs> I'm trying to find like a way to say it, uh, to just like not spoil it for you, of course. I think you'll find that he's way more human than you might think. Which is something that I've liked about the, this game. Like, uh, for example, for Ellen, the shark girl, uh, on her, like, trailers, you see her just, like, um, you see her on her, like, work mode, and you see her while she's, like, going to school and being around with, like, friends and having fun. And you can actually find her on the map, on, like, the overworld, while you're, like, walking around. And she just seems like a, a, a normal uh, teenage girl that's just doing her, like, part-time part job. And she's just like tired of it. It's just like, ugh, I don't want to work. Ugh. Which, you know, nobody wants to work. So <laughs> you kind of just get the feeling that you can, uh, uh, what's the word for it? Mm, you feel for her, kind of. He's more what than I think. Uh, well, you see Ben bigger, and he's usually just like on, uh, when you're playing him. As like a character, he's usually just like very tanky, and he just shows like a lot of like strength. But uh, hmm, I don't know. It's just like probably like the uh, a different idea that Ben Bigger actually gave to me. I thought he was just gonna be like more rough because you know that he has like a scar on one of his eyes. I think it's his left eye. So you think like he was like some sort of like delinquent or like some sort of like Doug, a criminal that ended up on a random construction project and he's working on that uh like at the moment maybe as a maybe voluntary work you know from like being in prison or something like that those are the ideas that i had of ben bigger when i actually saw him as a character but then as i played through the story i actually found that i was very very wrong and he's like way more human than i thought like he's got like a let's say ben bigger has a a very big heart to say the least <laughs> That's the idea that I got from like Ben Bigger. And why I mentioned that. Oh, and probably another thing that I mentioned with human uh, is that usually on gacha games and stuff like that, they're trying to go with the characters. They try to go for like a certain demographic. So usually they try to fit those characters on uh, a certain trope. Like for example, Ellen could have just been the maid girl. Uh, she could just be the lolly baba of the game and and be just that in the game and just like have nothing else. She could be like the the strict officer and just have nothing else to her character. But uh, from like the the character trails and stuff like that, you see that she's the uh, she's a strict officer. And when she's like in her casual mode, she's just like very shy. She doesn't approach. Uh, she doesn't approach many things by herself, um, and uh, she's scared of cats, and she actually lo really, really loves her family and is living away from her family, which I found really, really cute. I love the builder characters because my day job is in construction. Really? And that's why you like uh, Ben Bigger? What do you think about the other ones? Anton, Coletta, and uh, there's also Grace. Anton, Coletta, and Grace. I think those are the four construction characters that there are in the game. So they are. I swear I know this voice actor. I swear I know her, her VA from somewhere. But I don't know from where. It sounds super familiar. Later, Su Juan and Jing Yi return to the public security building. It's also a super good thing about gacha games is that you sh when they have like a lot of type of like characters that fit a lot of like different um, tropes or like um, roles, uh, you can usually just like find like a character that you really really end up liking or you can just feel very connected to, either just like by the things that they're doing or like maybe their like work or stuff like that. That's also super nice. I also really like when characters have the same birthday as me, but my birthday is like kind of difficult to have like a. It's not like a. Mm, it's a very specific date. It's like right at the middle of the year. So it's kind of difficult for like a character to have that birth year or like that birth date, June first. 
Like, I, th I think I've found maybe like three characters, anime characters, not like Gacha King characters, uh, that have had the, the same birthday as me. It's just like not very common of a date. Usually, uh, they start some sort of like event like Valentine's Day or maybe even Christmas or something. Somewhere that's close to those sort of like uh, uh, events or like dates, special dates, are the ones that are often chosen as. Uh, Birthdays for characters. Hmm. This is big, uh, they probably are they worried about us being proxy and that they're gonna be going to Sixth Street and we're gonna end up being in danger because they're just gonna be walking around and checking stuff out. Here it is. New Eddie Do Public Security. Neps. Nep. 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 Any treasure chest? No. Yes. One treasure chest. So much has happened today that I really don't. I really don't feel in the mood for food. Why? So let's get dinner together some other time. I'm gonna head back home. That's what you want. It sounds good to me too. Hey, what's our car doing over here? Oh, Suyan got someone to help move the car here. But you were getting your driver's license. Oh, got the driver's license. Nice. Mm, finally, we don't have to... Finally, we don't have to walk so far. When I took a closer look, I discovered tons more public security safety awareness month posters around the precinct. Precinct? But when you carry... When you compare it to the food tasting event at the convenience store, it's less appealing. Yeah, usually events like this aren't very appealing to the masses because uh, they're like very serious events instead of like for fun events. So it's kind of tough. Mitsuri Kanoroji, Mikoto Uchiha, Kasuya Kinishita, Kisara Nanjo, a lot of pretty cool characters. Ooh, who are these characters? Let's see. Mitsuri Kanoroji. Oh! Ah, Kimetsu no Jaiba, I see. Uh, Kasuya Kinishita? Wait, IQ? Kanoyo Karashimash. Oh, wait, is this one the uh, the one that gets flamed every so often? Yep, it is. Rent a girlfriend. Before you judge, I love Katsuya. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Everybody can love whatever they find. <laughs> I don't watch the uh, the anime or like the manga myself, especially because um, I don't know. It doesn't have like it's like trope. Doesn't like uh, draw any interest to me. But I'm not gonna end up hating on it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And it's Kisara Nanju. Not a wiki, just... Wait, I actually don't know her. Kenishi. Commonly known as Valkyrie. Ragnarok. Shinpaku Alliance Katsuchinken female. Actually, don't know. I think I've heard the name before, but I don't know much about this one. It looks old. It looks like a classic. Everybody dogs on rent A, but it's really good. So good. I'm gonna guess that it. I don't know if like the uh, if it's sort of like the thing because there's a lot of like rom coms or like harem manga, uh, or harem anime that usually start strong, but the more the uh. The longer they've been like on uh, like release, what's the word for it? The longer that they've been out, it's like they start running out of like ideas to sort of like make the uh, the whole problematic of just like not choosing like a girl. Uh, they just don't have any ideas to just like make it go low for longer. And usually there's some like really dumb stuff start getting like introduced into like the manga or like the anime. And I don't know if that might be like the case for Rent a Girlfriend. Um, but uh, it became popular for a reason, you know? 
So the start must be good at the very least, or like the uh, some something from like the plotline must be like really really good. Because just dirtbag to sweetheart route is long. Oh, so he gets a sort of like um, a redemption arc. I see. I think I have seen things about the uh, that manga and anim slash anime of like how pretty much the girls are supposed to be like in some sort of like trouble as usual with like uh harem mangas every single girl has like their own like problem and it's uh it's the job of the mc to actually just like get closer to them find out what the problem is and then find some sort of like way to actually get a, a solution for the girls which in turn ends up in uh gaining more affection points He just can't beat the NTR allegations. Now, nah, not after that. What the thing that happened with like the manga and the things that the uh, the mangaka has been posting on like Twitter. Have you seen those things, by the way? The things that the mangaka posts on Twitter. I think the last one that uh, that happened was that he literally took a picture of like his like um of him like doing like the laundry. And his clothes been together with someone else's clothes and he was just like oh no our clothes are getting intertwined instead of like the laundry no and it's just like hmm <laughs> i tried to avoid their story. yeah <laughs> i can probably see why he's not a uh, hmm well he does put out some content it's just that it's not the best of content and it's nothing that makes the uh, the manga look any better either, because you know, you, you see the person that's drawing it and the things that they're saying, and then you, you you see like the deranged stuff that he's bringing out, and the only thing that you can think about is just like, uh, I'm not sure if this is gonna be a good read, kind of thing. Ah, there it is. I wonder if this is from something before like we started playing as them. Mm, yeah, I was guessing that it was them when they mentioned two public security officers. Mm. Luckily, I didn't let anything slip. A lot of things happened that day. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's gonna be one of those things again, where we go over back and not back in time, but we get uh, to see some stuff that we missed from like the main story. Oh, right. Another thing that I found out while I was looking at stuff from like the newest version is that apparently a lot of people hate her fairy because apparently she talks a lot. Even though her job is to absolutely trash talk us at any possible moment. Some pretty good trash talk, I must say. And some fourth wall breaking as well. She does a couple of that. Just a little bit of that. Two days ago in the Pioneer's Memorial Plaza deep within the hollow. Yep. Uh, yes, it was my bad. Uh, my carrot malfunction. Oops. Uh, and we ended up doing something real big and saving the world. Yep. My bad. Mm -hmm. Oh, a sequel manga for Rent, a girlfriend. Did it just get it like announced? Let me look it up. It should be easy to find. Okay, this is not it. This ain't it either. Announced July 11 a, mo a month ago. Hmm. 
I do remember that also not too long ago. I don't know if you know about this uh, anime. Rascal, Rascal doesn't know. What's it called? Rascal. Rascal does not dream of Bunny Senpai. Of Bunny Girl Senpai. That one. Uh, that one apparently is getting an anime. Of like an university arc. Or like a sequel for like an university, university arc. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. I mean, that it's not ending. Because oftentimes, like, manga... You love Bunny Senpai? Really? Then have you checked that out? Like, the, uh, the university arc? Yep, we're faulty. Mm-hmm. You hardly read manga. Ah, oh, that's understandable. A lot of people like anime way more than manga, uh, especially because of how it's uh, uh, let's see, it's like a more compact sort of like media, and it's more exciting to actually watch it rather than read it. It's just that uh, before, I used to like watch Naruto, and One Piece, and Bleach. But there's like a point in time where it just like stops and the manga is still like going So you have two choices you wait for the next chapter to come out and hope it's not filler or You go over into the internet and you start reading the manga And so I started reading the manga and I started liking it and then I found a lot of more things that I could actually end up reading uh, Because anime can be like uh, it's kind of limited because of the seasons the uh, the seasonal anime so, and you're like way more free to actually just like fight something on the, mm, sorry. You're way more free to find something to read uh, in like the manga form, because of course, before they become an anime, they're like a manga. And then I just sort of started like, started liking it. And also the, uh, for Bunny Senpai, the, I really didn't expect it to be that sort of like anime or that sort of like series. I expected it to be some sort of like uh, romance, the, the usual like romance kind of thing. I did not expect there to be the, uh, whatchamacallit, the supernatural stuff, you know? Like, the bunny, bunny senpai, for her to actually be invisible or something like that, as, uh, the anime starts. I did not expect that at all. Cute. <laughs> mm -hmm. What it? Yep, she's 100% the lowly baba with this game. 1,000% from her using Wade. She's literally freedom. <laughs><笑> Yeah, seriously, I'm really curious about this. We don't know anything about cores either. Also, this name is pretty safe because you don't know about it yet. Mm. Oh, it's time to see her powers. Hmm? Inside the crystal. Pero. <laughs> this little expression of her, I saw it so on the internet and everywhere on Twitter. I saw it so much, especially because of Frieden. Because everybody remembers Frieden and Frieden uses this uh, this expression a lot. It's such a loved expression. <laughs> oh, it's this guy. He doesn't look like a great character. Seems like he might be a little bit annoying or overbearing. Maybe even a bad guy. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, I thought so. so <laughs> it's this type of character. Yeah, he only cares about PR. And I'm gonna guess that he cannot deal with ethereals. Kitty, what are you doing, man? Mm. The election is just around the corner. My election. Alright, I see. He's, he's actually gonna be trash. He's gonna be a, a terrible character because he's gonna try to hide a bunch of things in order for it to not affect his like, image. Uh... Damn it. Okay. Have to check something on my phone real quick. ご安心ください。収集した証拠はハンドに引き渡し、専門的な分析にかけてもらうよう申請しました。結果はすぐ出るかと。うん。何？証拠をハンドに引き渡す。あ。君たちのやり方は間違っていない。<笑> He is gonna try to hide it. This little piece of crap. We need this information. We need it for the lore. So give me a second. Let me check something on my phone. Could I answer some messages? Don't tilt anymore. Mm, then I wonder if the whole thing about going to Sixth Street and working for the, uh, the little like event that they have is probably just like a distraction, so they don't end up working on the ethereal. In the workshop, the footage of the investigation has played to the end. <laughs> Yeah, it's probably just the thing that they're gonna start. Well, the thing is that the hollows are just such a, like a normal thing that are going on in like this world, and uh, a lot of like it seems like the hollows aren't just like fully like explored. Like we don't know what's inside them. We just know that there's ethereals, and there might be like buildings or like pieces of like the uh, of architecture from like the, the area that got swallowed up. But uh, we don't know if there might be like any danger inside. So it's like, uh, I don't think this world has like some sort of like way to actually tell if there's like a high level ethereal inside of like a hollow, with the exception of like the hollow randomly growing. Because apparently like a, there being like a big hollow means that there's like a big ethereal inside of it. As we've known from uh, the, uh, what's it called? The Dead End Butcher. And what's the new one called as well? I can't remember what it's called. Neve... Neveral? Mm. Whatever that flower monster is. Because it had already been done and pro hand is probably a... like a step over the public security office because they're like more specialized. Probably they're more important than the public security office. It's a 100% a distraction to like to delay it. Yeah. 
情報はないか。ルミナスクエア、治安パトロール強化月間で検索中。複数のメディアで言及を見つけました。うん、読み上げます、うん。今月に入ってから、市内で重大事件が頻発していることを受け。ヤヌスク治安局は、治安維持と市民の防犯意識向上のため。治安パトロール強化月間イベントの展開を決定。うーん、do they really fear? Is the guy really like afraid of the fact that the, another major incident is just gonna affect his chances at getting elected? And is that why he's like trying to hide it? Is that it? Because they've mentioned given the recent search in major incidents, a lot of things have been happening. There's the thing that happened with Vision Corp. Uh, what happened in chapter one? Oh, the Red Gang. The thing that happened with the, like, the Red Gang also went into like, the news. I saw it on the newspaper, on the newspaper stand. Vision, the thing with Vision Corp as well, even though we didn't catch the uh, the actual culprit, the uh, the pretty woman that was like doing everything from like from the shadows. <laughs> うん。今回のイベントの発起人として、エヌスク総局の副総監グリンガー氏もルミナ文書での講習に自ら出席するもよう。その際、長官は今回のイベントを担当する I'm not so sure. Uh, from the trailer, I don't think Su Jian is like the best person to be going to an interview. She's totally gonna screw it up. ついないしてたよ。ベラさんは6分ぐらいに来るとき、私たちもイベントに参加したいって言いに行こう。Bella's <laughs> always so damn annoying, although I really like her Japanese name. Uh there's like something very unique about like the different versions of the game. I'm not sure about Korea or or Chinese, but on English it's uh Bell and Wise. On Japanese it's Rin and Akira. I don't know about fairy. Oh right, fairy, fairy is fairy. Fairy is just like fairy on katakana. Besides the participant's name and address, the public security questionnaire include a few general questions on security. If you aren't really interested, I'll go ahead and fill it up for you. Thanks, that's so considerate. Thank you, Belle. Oh, it says here that citizens who participate in the event can draw a prize based on their survey ID on the day of the lecture. And the prize is going to be a videotape. Uh, what videotape? Major traffic accidents of New Eridu. Net of justice, no escape, and whole safety is important. Documentaries? I get the feeling the police security ordered too many copies. It's just an add-on to the event anyway. Anyway, just leave the survey to me. It's getting late, wise, so let's get some rest. I'm heading upstairs then. See you tomorrow. Get a good night's sleep. The next few days are busy with organizing the shelves and recommending videos to customers. Then... Wise, you asked about Su Yuan and Qing Yi. What a coincidence. I was just about to tell you. I heard from Fairy that she's been seeing Su Yuan and Qing Yi around here since yesterday. I hope I'm not butchering their names, but I probably am. I already filled out the questionnaire they gave uh, they gave me earlier. Whenever you have time, we can go find them. Why don't we go now? Yes, I still have time to stream. Although this is not going to be like a very long stream, I'm probably going to stream to like, um, maybe just one more hour. Yeah, I think one more hour would be fine because uh, I'm going to have to eat. I'm going to have to consume nutrients. Kitty. Kitty always uses like the worst positions ever. I have like a little, uh, what's it called? 
I have something so I can put like my feet on uh, instead of it just being like the floor because I like to have my, my grippers out. I feel more comfortable like that. And uh, yeah, my kitty just really likes just like lay there because it's like comfortable. And usually she's like a very, very big kitty. So whenever she like lays down, she just takes up so much space. So it gets like really hard to find like a position for like uh for me to be able to sit with comfortably without my feet being like in super uncomfortable positions. And I end up uh kicking or like stepping on my kitty on accident. Right? Tina. Right, I'm not gonna call her name more because whenever she starts looks looking at me like that and I start calling her name, she gets like all excited and she thinks like it's rubby time. So, and it's not on me. Don't, don't get up. Okay. <laughs> it is currently not rubby time. Uh, I'll probably won't be doing the daily video store yet. Just in case I get more videotapes. Where are they? All right. Something that I really like about this game as well is all the designs that the NPC have. Like, look at all this drip. She looks so cute. I love it. I love her little, like, uh, what would this be called? Braids? Twin braids? I'm actually not sure. I'm terrible at fashion, so I don't know, like, the names of hairstyles or anything of the sort. But yeah, I really like that. Even hers. It's, like, really nice. She has some sort of, like, Himekat. I like her expression as well. She's cute. The usual, uh, sweater guy. Casual sweater guy. Construction job, dude. General shop, just being general shop. Oh, and my favorite character of them all, Mr. Panda. I still have no idea what the hell these things are. But he's cute. <laughs> he's very cute. I want a Mr. Oh, actually, I don't know. Do I want a Mr. Panda plushie or would I want a Bangboo plushie first? Mmm. It's a tough one. Oh. What's going on? Rest assured, Mr. Enzo, it's just a public security event. Uh, something's going on. It's with people that we know as well. Tin Master from the coffee shop and Mr. Enzo from the bank boo shop all the way back there. What's going on? Criminal cases. Uh, Man, running out of battery. We just plug it in. もうすぐレミナ文書で専門的な安全講習を開きますので時間があれば是非ご参加ください。<笑> Mm, it's expected. The issue with things where you need quantity is that you're gonna have to drop your quality, so yeah. But everyone loves coffee. Well, a lot of people love coffee. I like coffee. Mm. And this reminds me that I really want an air purifier one of these days. It'll help a lot because Kitty just keeps throwing her fur around everywhere. While fine wines develop into richer experiences with time, other worthy items can go bad. I'm gonna guess that he's trying to like trash talk the uh the deputy commander officer guy. He's just like going bad. He's like getting sort of like corrupt maybe because he wants to just get elected. So he's trying to like brush things aside and he's doing he's not doing things by the book. <laughs> Mm. Mm. 
六分街でカスタムショップを経営しておるとのこと講習に興味は終わりかいやー裏若いお嬢さん二人に誘われた But... 当然参加しない手はないんだけどなその日はちょうど俺が一番上のおばさんの<笑>そのまた二番目のおばさんのじいさんの息子のいとこの結婚式なんだ大事な仕事なんで欠席するわけにはいかなくてな<笑> This is like one of the worst excuses ever My second aunt's grandfather's son's cousin is getting married that day なるほどそれではその大おばさまにご結婚おめでとうとお伝えくだされ And I'm pretty sure she caught on to that えー、っと<笑>ああそうだもうすぐ車を取りに来る客がいるんだった。急に思い出したぜ。I wonder if Mr. Enzo might be a little bit more scared of attending a public security event. More because he's like helping me, the proxy, with like my bank boo needs and like equipping bank boo with like weapons and stuff like that. Which is probably not very legal. I, I think it's not very legal. But、uh, I don't know why Tin Master would say no. Maybe it's just like.、Uh, Tin Master has like a very bad image of the public security office, especially because of the、uh, deputy commander just being such an ass. Like a bad person. And there's our names. Hira, Tin. それは。Because they're just about the public security office instead of there being like an actual good price. I don't know, maybe even like a coffee machine would be nice, you know, as like the top price and have like the rest of the prices be like garbage, maybe like consolation prize, things like some candy. Maybe even that would help. But、uh, yeah, it's just like not looking very good for the public security office. <laughs> But it's the truth, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shin. That's the Japanese pronunciation. なんか僕たちに手伝えることはあるかいそういうことで言えばヌシラ二人にお教えを請いたいのだがうんふん六分街の住民台帳には名前だけで住所は登録されておらん者たちがいるなんかヌシラ二人にお教えを請いたいのだ
みんなちゃんと聞いてくれると思うよですがあなたたちの手を煩わせるわけには Don't be shy All right, they did solve Bell's life 地元の人間として当然のお返しさ周囲ね門を入り出てはいるしを訪ねよ<笑>ありがとうございます。Or if they still have like the Loli Baba sort of like a、uh, trope going for the English version, I wonder if the voice actors doing like a good job to portray it. It's probably like the hardest thing. Japanese voice actors are just like so damn talented. We have to find Asha, General Shop, and Spike and give them the public security survey. Asha and General Shop should be at their stores right about now. As for Spike, he left his address when he'd registered as a member at the store. Ferry's going to send it over. Okay? Let's get to it. But first, let's、uh, see what's going on with them. Hello there, citizen. Could you please take a look at this survey? Full security is hosting a lecture on safety at the Lumina branch. Feel free to attend if you're interested. Oh, it's just a lecture? Don't you guys do exercises like confronting bad guys and stuff like that? Sorry, I'm just afraid it's just a lecture for now. Sounds boring. You would consider doing an exercise? I could play a corpse. I've been great at holding my bread ever since I was young. Okay. Uh, the exercises at a public security aren't like filming a movie. You don't need to hold your breath or anything. Just lie still and don't move. Ah, so you do agree to change the lecture into an exercise. <laughs> It looks like I played myself. Whoops. Wait, where's that?、Oh, it's at the end of the,、uh, this like, street here. Wait, actually, I have never seen the person,、uh, a single person over here. Is this going to be Acha? A p a r m e r n gate. Hmm? Spike should leave here. Try to ring the doorbell. Ding! Darn salespeople, it never ends! I've said it time and time again. I've got no teeth, so I don't need your electric toothbrush. No, no, actually, I'm. What? Not the toothbrush? Well, then, I've got no hair, so I don't need your darn curling iron either. Spike, we're the managers from Random Play. Oh, the video store. One moment. Soon after, the door finally opens. Old man, you do have hair! Wait, it's a wig. It has to be a wig. His eyebrows are just completely white. This has to be a wig. Oh, what if you came out? How many videotapes have we forgotten to return this time? I'm sorry, my memory is short. I'm old, I'm also old. No, no, we're actually here for something else. Could you please take a look at this survey? Hmm? Now, there's an unsettling face. That bringer lad, isn't it? Sorry, my eyes are not what it used to be. I can't read the words clearly. Could you youngsters read it for me? Mm hmm. Tell Spike about the public security's security event. Hmm. For the sake of urban security and the safety of us residents. That sounds lovely! If they really cared about their residents, they wouldn't be chasing around after proxies. In the end, all the benefit is just for tops. Thank you for both bringing the survey over, but as you can see, these legs of mine aren't so stable. I don't really want to go wandering off as far as Luminous Square. Could you please tell the officers? Sure. And it also does look that the,、uh, the public security does have a pretty bad reputation. As for the reason for him saying that,、uh, that they shouldn't be chasing proxy, does Spike know that I'm a proxy? I wonder. Asha. Another one of everyone's.、Uh, another one of the NPCs that everyone loves. Hello, you two. It's been a while since I saw both of you at the arcade together. Are you here to play some matches? Not today, Acha. We're here for something else today. Could you please take a look at the survey? Oh, are you researching new movie genres to stock in your store? It's actually a public security survey. Ah,、uh, don't tell me you guys got busted by public security and now you're doing community service. Does everybody here know that I'm a proxy? Were you selling pirate videotapes or burning illegal discs? Or I wonder if this still happens. I remember when I was a kid that this was like very、uh, about pirating videotapes and burning illegal discs was just like a very prevalent. 
let's say. It happened a lot. I remember that I had a couple of friends that would actually have uh, illegal discs for like games or movies. They just like randomly buy on the street. What happened to basic trust between people? <laughs> I'm just kidding. There are just too many secretive residents on 6th Street, and your siblings give off a somewhat mysterious vibe. I wouldn't be surprised if I found out one day you were the number one most wanted on public security's most wanted list. Well, we were kind of the top number one proxy, and being a proxy is pretty bad, so we're probably somewhere around there. That's about right. Uh, <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I guess we were the number one that they were uh, trying to find the number one proxy. So, yeah. I see. You're just helping out an officer you know. Well, as long as you're okay, that's what matters. Actually, last time I was at Lumina Square, I saw public security had set up a promotional booth. I heard that on the day of the lecture, lots of media outlets will be in town conducting interviews. It seems like public security is really putting a lot of effort into this exchange event. It might be worth checking out, don't you think? Exchange event. That may be the case for regular citizens like you and me, but for some people, it could mean something entirely different. You mean? Nothing. I was just mumbling to myself. Is she trying to talk about it being just some sort of like marketing scheme or PR scheme? Anyways, thanks for bringing the survey over, but unfortunately, I don't really have time that afternoon. Please pass, pass that on to the officers for me. Up oh, to down. I can understand Spike is old and doesn't want to travel too far, but I didn't expect someone usually so open to helping out, like Asha, to shoot us down. General Shop's the only one left. Oh, look, Wise. General Shop's back. Let's go talk to him. Did he ever leave? Oh, I think he did leave, uh, because it was someone. Someone else was like right here standing, and I'm gonna guess that we had. Uh, if I try to go for General Shop first, I'd have to talk to them, and then that person would tell me that General Shop's not here. Oh. Okirani,よく来たな。Even though I didn't do it, it's still like kind of like a part of the lore that I, you know, uh, was looking for him. You already know. Shop Taisho. Most Tetanoka. Oh, you talk on him, so he right. Nanika to Jijo to Ninarunda. That is so true. Whenever you go to like a restaurant, like a very, very local restaurant, instead of like a fast food place, you end up finding out about a lot of stuff, like random stories, just like from uh, people just talking about them in there. And people don't like whisper. Or any of the stories. Just like if you're there, you're gonna end up listening to it because they scream about it. They tell you all about it, even though if you're not in the conversation. Yeah, I mean, literally everyone has said no to us. We still don't really know why. I wonder if General Shop is going to tell us. Oops. Spike is not in my chat. Hmm. I'm probably gonna have to go to a Seribot stream and tell her to get back in here. Oh. I mean, for we definitely don't know anything about this because I'm, I'm pretty sure we just recently moved to Sixth Street because uh, the siblings were from Old Eridu or the Old Capital, as they call it, before when it like got destroyed by the whole zero. 
チラシに書いてあるこの男。<laughs> nope, but I guess before that he was gonna be trash, so he's probably trash, and you're probably gonna tell us that he's trash. Hollow hero. Nope. But he doesn't look like a hero. Oh, he is the hero. Mm-hmm.住人たちとの距離も近かったし。But I'm gonna guess that he, he got to his head or he got into trouble with like some depth or whatever, and now he's just like sort of like corrupt or like not a very nice person. Hmm. That's how he can known as a whole hero. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, usually when you start going up, uh, when they call it, oops. Mm, yeah, he is putting a front in front of the cameras. あの野郎は明らかにトップスにするよって言いながら。あいつが治安局で進めてるとかいう取り組みのほとんど。yeah the money got to his head and now he's like a corrupt cop so he's no longer the hollow hero あいつは今ヤヌスクの次期総監を見据える場所にいるかな時期にやれイベントだてめえの顔をチラシにするだ何のためにやってんのかは俺が言うまでもねえだろ Hmm. It's like he's using public resources for his personal gain. So, Kangaruto, Bringa Chokan Yate Rukotoa, Scotch Kohe Sani Kakeriona Kimosuna. Yeah, he is trying to advertise himself. So, Anzen Koshu the Nandatero, Betsni Yatarina. So, no, we should have bring an Eroga Nanika Takuran der Nogato Moto. Kokoro, Diakani Sanka Dekine, Tenamon. That's fair. That's fine, General Shop. You're not. We're not gonna force you to go. お兄ちゃん、ひとまずご近所さん三人のところを回ったし、ちょっと言いづらいけど、帰って主演さんたちに結果を伝えよう。Oh, okay, for a second I thought that I had to talk to Mr. Panda. I wish I could talk to Mr. Panda. I wish. Suyan. Hmm. 
講習に参加したいという市民は10人にも満たない。ジュエン人事を尽くして天命を待つとは個人の言葉言ったではないかことここに至っては白湯でも飲んで一息つくしかあるまい先輩はお気楽に言いますけどね講習を行う会場の収容人数は300人ですよこのままだと当日は半分だって埋まりませんブリンガー長官がイベントにこの場所を選んだのも付近に住民が多く参加者を集めやすいと踏んだゆえであることは自明。いや、エンジェネラルショップ already told us that、uh, Officer Bringer actually worked here in this like area before, so maybe he thought that it'd be a good idea to actually come over and that his old friends would be going to actually help him. But Every single person here already knows what、uh, Officer Bringer is doing, and it's not good. So, they got all you nebri or seca. Oh, maybe.、Mm. Okay, maybe he didn't know. Sigh. Hey, I wonder if Sujan was saved from like that one hollow where Bringer became the hollow hero. よほどつらいのであろうブリンガー長官が私をホロから救ってくださらなかったら、うん、私は治安官になることはおろか生きてここにいることもなかったでしょうからいや、さて、ブリンガーは何者の人間だここ数年、yeah. 長官の評判が芳しくないことは知っていますですがあの人はたった一つしかない大使を子供に譲るという選択のできる人です。And this could be the reason why he got lost どうして悪い人になれると。In the hollow and barely made it back。確かに長官はトップスと信仰がありますが、それは治安局の設備の多くがトップスとの共同開発であるため、彼らとの付き合いは避けられないことです。Mm, but even when we saw him on the little cutscene, it seemed like he was more worried about himself than anything else. He's certainly just like thinking about profits and just like himself instead of like, you know, helping the people. Maybe or maybe he'll become worse. We don't know. Well said. Well said. Worshipping an undeserving deity 
or person is psychophancy. Failure to act when action is needed shows a lack of courage. Very, very well said. われらは治安官として何をすべきで、そして何をすべきではないのか、それを知ることが最も肝要。ブリンガー長官のなすことには、人によって異なる解釈があろう。And from the way that he was acting, I doubt he has a clear conscience. It is us. Sorry for interrupting you guys. Yeah. Didn't go well. The役に立てなくて。うん。大丈夫です。彼らに取り継いでくれただけでも十分感謝しています。六分外ではこれ以上アンケートを取れそうにありません。今日のところは私と先輩は局に戻りますね。ロサックスフォーダムだ。あ。チ
Oh, it's gift change. But how, but how could you have gone all the way up there to open the uh, the cargo compartment? And two, I don't think Give Change is a very smart bang boo. Sorry, Give Change. To be doing something like this. うん。運転手さん、あなたの証言は記録しました。そこのボンプ君、この件について何か言いたいことはありますか？うんうん。Your name, okay? And your occupation? No, 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 no. So somebody else did it. But yeah, like bamboos don't really have much power to like easily open something like that, like the compartment door of like a truck. Like they need to get up on like the little step, and then they have to jump up to reach like the handle. Mm. Yeah, I don't think either of the three bank booths are are one for one convenience store are like bad people. They're not the smartest either to be doing something like this. So it's just like yeah, they're not bad and they're not smart, so I don't find like a reason for them to be doing this. I don't know, you tell us. Uh, I got like a little bit of tinnitus a second ago. I just waited for my hearing to come back. Somewhere not far away from the crowd. It is us. <laughs> yeah. He's very passionate about coffee, so he was probably very offended. うん。でも、ネブネバーテイクマニーアウェイフロムライクデカスタマーズイダー。うん。でも、ネブネバーテイクマニーアウェイフロムライクデカスタマーズイダー。うん。でも、ネブネバーテイクマニーアウェイフロ
おまけにこのあたりは街灯カメラもないよ。現時点で調査できるのは、ポンプの資格記録。そしてトラックの盗難防止システムのみ。But we can't tell her that we can do that. We're just random dudes that are running a video shop. Why would we have the technology to look into the a b a n g b o o s visual record? <laughs> What do we do? Do we tell them that we can help? <laughs> さすがに治安官の前じゃな。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。Oh, so that's why they left. They're trying to help give change. Hmm. I'm gonna guess that they have to say now they were the first officers to the scene of like crime. アヒルがすべて戻ってくるまでにまた衝突が起こらないとは限りませんしばらくはここにいるべきだと判断しましたまた本来は所轄の治安官が担当する案件ですが、ね、するのにも時間がかかります But... like... 3 hours last night. <笑> I need to finish this uh... Just okay, 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 この事件には確かに疑わしい点もありますから。私と先輩はアヒルを探しつつ、付近で他の手がかりも探してみることにします。Now that I think about it, all this like special powers that a lot of characters have, like ether powers, like, like the thing that Shinji did, there has been like no explanation as to why they can do that. Maybe on the lore of the game there might be some explanation, but I need to check it out. <laughs> Why can we talk? You could say that. When it comes to finding things on Sixth Street, we got a very resourceful, resourceful little help, helper. Know what I'm saying? Fairy? You mean fairy? Yep. Fairy should be able to pinpoint exactly where the ducks are hiding. I already asked her to mark out any suspicious locations nearby. Then we can focus on the places she marked for us. Suspicious places? There are far too many. Yeah, we need to check quite a few places. Since there are four of us, how do you feel about splitting up? Or Oh yeah, because of Suyan and Qingyi. I'll go with Qingyi and you can team up with Suyan. I should speed things up considerably. Okay, it's decided then. What's going on between them? Give change wants to see their friends. Everyone, people are worried about give change. No way, what am I supposed to do if you run off? You're not going anywhere until all the docks have been found. Okay, give change waits here. Won't go anywhere. Poor give change. Poor little guy. Investigate the remodeling shop? Really? In here? What, you think there might be docks behind this door? Ah, Wise, listen, I can definitely hear ducks walking coming from behind this door. But we were miles away from here. How did you notice this place? I just had a vague feeling. You know, I'm pretty good at finding stuff, so I just had a feeling, you know. <laughs> food arrived, so I need to get <laughs> I need to be fast and finish this as fast as possible. Oh, Kitty's afraid now because I actually stood up. Sorry, Kitty. What 
time is it? It's already two? No. It's not even close. The name of this store is Turbo. Ah, so this is Enzo's shop. But he doesn't look to be in. The door's locked tight. Creak and bang. What's that sound? Then there was an accident at the intersection. Let's go take a look. Huh? An act? Whoa! Oh my, what happened here? It really gave me a fright. Aunt Megan. Now, police security officer, can you tell me what happened here? I don't have a clue. Uh, I really don't know. It's just suddenly, it happened so fast. Yep, 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 yep. Damn, calm down. Chill out. Why is it Mr. Public Security Officer? Allow me to explain. And Megan is a customer of mine. And she's here to get her vehicle repaired. When she was about to leave, the car suddenly turned and rammed into this bank boot. Hmm, was it an accident? Impossible. I released the brakes really slowly when I drove it out of the parking lot earlier. And I held the steering wheel firmly too. But it just went out of control for some reason. Miss Police Security Officer, please believe me, I absolutely did not break the law. I could attest to that. Its directions were a little off now. I'll just take a look at it immediately. Who's thing Bang Boo belong to? Oh, don't worry about it. A friend of mine left it here. Should be fine. Probably just a plug-in error caused by impact. I'll fix it up later. Mm. I can deal with the basic issues. I almost forgot that you know a thing too about this too. Alright, I'll leave this little guy to you. Alright, puzzle time. Mm, can I talk to them? Nope. Puzzle time. Uh, okay. You see enough? Next time I should probably do it backwards. It'll probably be faster if I do it backwards. Not long after. What happened just now? Mm, you were in a car accident. I remember now. I went to grab the tools in a large white and green metal box and then took a turn. I think that it really is a vehicle malfunction accident, like what she and Mr. Enzo said. Why, well, thanks for fixing this little guy for me. It'll take a little more time to find out what's wrong with the car. Alright, I saw you around the store earlier. Were you looking for me? Uh, I think a duck ran inside your shop. I see. I'll open the door for you all now. Thank you, Enzo. <laughs> ah, the goose is loose. Ah. It really is inside the store. This is great. We found one. Thanks for helping me, Mr. Enzo. You're welcome. Um, well, this one is... These fries are really hard. Mm. It's really hard to eat. As I heard about the incident Game Shay was involved in, it should help out too. But something strange about Miss, Miss Megan's car, and she's very anxious, so I have to help her first. Mm. You do what you need to do first. Mm. I'm just gonna tire my jaw 100 percent There we go. I'll leave it to you for now then. I'll come and help out after I'm done over it over there. Blah, 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 blah. All duck out of its cage. A duck that escaped from a Pegaso truck. Catch it and take it back. A new breed of domestic dog bred by the famous farm in Eridu Valley. The driver, Gail from Pegasus, was responsible for transporting them, but for unknown reasons, the vehicle's cargo compartment was open and these bracelet ducks scattered and escaped. Alright, so it seems like there's something weird going on with maybe electronic thingies. Maybe the truck has like an electronic lock and it opened by itself. The thing that happened to Belle with like her, uh, I don't know what's wrong with it. Uh, the thing that happened with Belle with her phone that made it so that she almost got ran over and now this so there's something going on very suspicious indeed hey i think something was shaking inside this drink box i just crumpled up a, uh, just a crumpled up ball of paper it's really like the wind just blew it over the ball uh, of paper has been soaked by the rain but i can still make out a few words my life is growing duller by the day only now do I realize how stupid I was before and how much I've let you down. Forgive me, forgive me and come back to me, okay? Judging by the condition of the paper right now, you have a pretty good idea of how the recipient responded. Yeah. Crumple it up and throw it away. 
Despite being a tragedy, there's no use holding on to regrets. People have to take responsibility for their own actions. Since becoming a public security officer, I've witnessed this too many times to count. There are some more words on the back. Oh yeah, let's see. I start to completely forget about Melania, Sansa, Eleanor, and Shaoya. Because you are my... One, two, three, four... Alright, you're garbage. Hmm? Is this the person who wrote the got a letter really apologizing? What does it feel like they're bragging? Good, at least it's not a tragedy anymore. Yep, correct. As you may be, it's best practice to not snoop into other people's private affairs. We should get down to business. Yeah, it definitely wasn't a, a tragedy for the girl that's uh, living that guy. Uh, getting shit on by um, like like four people. Ugh. Woof. And we're back with Shinji and Bell. Ah, here you are, wise. What are you all doing standing here? Mostly because there's a duck under that convenience store truck. See, it's right there. Uh... What are you waiting for then? It's for you to say. It's hiding so far underneath the truck. There's no way we can actually... You girls are so slim and small. You can do it. I'm sure you can. Maybe we need to come up with another plan. Mm... Try clocking like a duck. Are you trying to sound like a hawk? You know they're the main predators of the ducks, right? From what I know about my brother, he's probably trying to mimic... <laughs> he's probably trying to mimic some duck-like species. I'm sorry, I'm so useless. <laughs> Maybe could we get the truck owner to start the car? Maybe the duck will run out if they feel like the car is moving. Makes sense, I'll go, fi go find the convenience store, bang, boo. Not long after. Ask! You want me to start the engine? No problem. Mm, it won't start? No way, what is it happening right now? Strange, there must be something wrong with the truck. It just worked just fine this morning. What terrible luck today. Give change got in trouble, and now our truck's broken down for no reason. Give change is always with us. If the owner thinks Give change has done something bad, we will get separated. Don't worry, we'll find all the lost ducks, and the officers will get to the bottom of the accident. And you won't get separated. Thank you. What are we going to do about the duck that's under the truck? The best place to find the helping hand is at the end of your own arm. Let me handle this. Oh? Shinji pushes the truck over to the other side. Uh, uh, yeah. So about what was what I was saying about uh, us not knowing what why they have this like sort of like super human powers. Wait, is she a robot? I just noticed. I know I have been looking at her tummy for quite a while, and I saw this little like uh, which we'll call it tattoo kind of things. And I was curious as to why she had this. Maybe she had like some sort of like lore, but now that I notice, she has just like lines on her like thighs. So I wonder if she's a robot. Yeah, the duck was still stunned. I still went ahead and grabbed it. You've got some incredible strength, Chingy. Now that we retreat this duck, let's look somewhere else. After some research, you and Bell countered catch, and it seems only one duck is on the loose at that moment. Huh? There's a DM from Fairy. It's like a biological signal has been detected near the back of the parking lot. Let's go take a look. Hmm. And another duck. Shinji's still here. I kind of want to look at her a little bit more. See if I can find more dull things. Like joints or something like that on her body. Oh, there he is. Hey, little ducky. It's really so cute. So small. You think you could just hide here and everything would be fine? How naive! Listen, you may be a fugitive, but it's still not too late to turn things around. I suggest you surrender and turn yourself in. Any last words? You gotta deal with us. We can still talk out of it. Keep resisting and alone we get worse. What's going on here? You two running a drama class or something? Nah, I'm going on with them. I'm joining them. Uh, look, I know you guys are having lots of fun. We are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pass on this one. Aww, Chuyon. Shinji, you better grab it before it runs away again. Shinji effortlessly stuffs the fugitive into her sack. Maybe this is a joint as well, right here. Thank you for your hard work. The driver just DM me. Others have also sent back the ducks they found while we were searching. Plus the one we just caught. That's all of them. Alright, great job. 
The Ducks were all hiding in a really obscure spot. It was all thanks to you noticing this place isn't, uh, this place is at all. If you hadn't been, if I hadn't been with you the whole time, I might have suspected that you were actually the one hiding ducks. <laughs> well, you had some other way of knowing uh, all the going around, all the going on, goings on around the neighborhood. I've never used this word before. But uh, yeah, that might be the case. Mira. Yes. I don't know what my cat is doing. She's just sniffing, being a little sniffer. She's not to be taken lightly. Shinji, I know it's supposed to be a compliment, but it came out a bit weird. I'm sorry, only meant to say that these two could make good public security officers. If we weren't criminals, of course. Now that we found all the ducks, let's get back to the truck. Cool, let's go. Hmm? One sec, wise. Look over there. Are our headlights flashing? Let's go check it out. Hmm? It is, and only a single one. That's weird. Oh, finally. I don't remember. I definitely wouldn't remember if I turned it off or not. Like, I probably would have thought that I turned them off. But the moment that uh, that somebody tells me, oh, maybe you forgot about it, then I'd start doubting myself, like, immediately. Mm. Bell opens the car door and tries to turn the lights off. Hmm. Or something's going on with the car. That's actually cool that they actually say that. The battery's gonna die because that's a normal thing in real life. Something really suspicious is going on around here. Does that sound familiar? Mm -hmm. The thing with Enzo and Megan and the little bang boo. Mm -hmm. It's like she picked up on it. Just smart. Nushi. Nushi. So yeah, I don't doubt that the um the truck had that some sort of like electronic lock and it got disengaged but by whatever is going on. Mm-hmm. But the car was still like speeding and on the sidewalk. And that too. Hey Juliet, how's it going? Like what happens when you normally lose connection, like the TV or something like that? Oh? Hmm? Right back booths are also electronic. Is is the unidentified an unidentified ethereal actually doing something? 
is the fact that it's now out and about on the world just like affecting electronics in some way shape or form but since the unidentified ethereal actually got killed and it shouldn't have the power to affect the electronics anymore and they weren't there while we were fighting so uh, wonder what it was taking the fight uh, the fast way over real quick Thank helping me and getting the ducks back. Otri, Boko and Shuen San to Chin, Coco de Matsio, you baratanda. Conoso Tachima Kita Itakare. No, 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 no. Yeah, they were here. The green officer checked on me, and the red one asked questions, which I didn't quite understand. Hmm. They figure something out, maybe? Hmm.。で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、
犯人が見つかるのは時間の問題ですよ犯人は今日だけで EMP 発生装置を何度も使用しています、うん、複数の事件現場に共通して映り込んでいた人物を調べればかなり絞り込めますからおシュエンチアンカご依頼のあった監視記録の調査が完了しましたこれまでに該当する不審人物は1名現在通りの出口付近で追跡中です尋問を行いますか確保しないすぐにやってくださいナイス了解です<笑>申し訳ありません逃げられました現在そちらの方へ向かっているものと思われます I smell a cutscene 先輩急ぎ捕らえましょう So Yen and Shinji immediately head off to cut off the enemy off,、uh, to head off to cut the enemy off and ambush them. And you and Bell follow suit. Later, next to a companion hollow on 14th Street. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Shinji! <laughs> I knew it. She's a robot. Nice. Ah,、oh, wait, he's going into the hole. Ooh. Cotia Shuenho. Yogi Shah Horoe Toso. Kikizuki Sisex. Yokai Ganjona Yatsio. Take again, Muyo de Ato. Jokioa. Hani a Horoni Nigata. Ato Oimas. Tariwa Hino. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> I love her so much. A few minutes later, inside the video store. But isn't it that scary? I mean, what if they find out who we are? What excuse are we going to give them? Of course. Also, threw a cat at Chindi. きっちりお年前はつけさせないとね。うん。お兄ちゃん、準備できたらいつでも出発できるよ。She's right now. Second assistant, the hollow information I have is more comprehensive than the temporary carry issued by public security. I can provide effective help. However, please note that the, series, the previous verbal threats used by the,、uh, public security officers were ineffective methods of pursuit. It is recommended to shoot at the target selects to immobilize it. Fairy, security officers can be,、uh, can't use force recklessly when appre apprehending, <laughs> apprehending suspects, let alone shoot them. Hmm, speaking of which, a hollow might be a good place to catch such a slippery person. Invisible assistant. Let's go. I need to finish the interlude. It's like a whole chapter, though. Oh, God, this is gonna be rough. Ah. Give me a second. How long is this? Like three to four quests? All right, let's do this fast. Oh, Suyan! Ooh, I don't know how to use her yet. Oh, I haven't done her thing. This might be a little rough. But she's still looking real cool while doing it. <laughs> Yeah, 
This is so cool. <laughs> We don't get to see anything about Shinji though. I guess they just hadn't finalized like her, the way that she was going to be doing things, so they didn't showcase anything about her. There we go. Crack my wrist. あなた様の小柄な体格を利用して静かに近づき適切なタイミングで手を貸しましょう。うん。罪を認めて投稿しなさい。お兄ちゃん聞いてあの人たちはすぐ下だよ。Got a super LA Noir kind of like music too. Uh, press the button? What does this do? Ooh! Hang on. Oops. There we go. Use this. Get some extra money. Go down here for this. Bum bum bum! So it has a range of two squares. And the fast way up. This is probably how I'm gonna end up using her as a trial character. Pretty good, Juliet. How about you? Just playing some video games. Trying to finish this so that I can do the event. Four, five, six, seven. He. The music is still kind of goofy and L.A. Nori. Oh, perfect timing. I like that she has like the same thing as Billy, where she can actually like dodge to the side. I wonder if I can do it multiple times. Yeah, I can. I still have no idea how to play as her. Oh, it's just my ult, just in case this is the last enemy. Big shot, and yeah, that was the last one. <laughs> I did see that you sent me one, but I didn't take a full look at it. I only glanced over it. I was kind of busy after uh, yesterday's stream and things. Actually, I was really busy the entire uh, afternoon, so I couldn't really check it. <laughs> Oh, 
Seriously, the ethereals pick up on so many things. Radio signals, EMP, sound, vibration. He might even become an ethereal himself. Hmm. Oh? Generations? She is old. これは。遥か先祖より伝わり<laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it was us that gave her the hint. Mm. Because of the EMP. <laughs> Someone's angry. <laughs> Oops. On the other side. あの Okay, there we go. Senpai, Coco de la Torimas. Ah, Cabeno, when you are no other kid, or hope is a kid at the cana, you know, so to surely the kid ever, or who can it's Caracamo. What happened? What am I looking at? Do I just touch it? Has on Stakaido no Nibuni, access to Shimashta. え、アナルパソ。カイロの断絶。カイロの部品に触れて位置を変え、接続したものを。カイロの部品をいじってみよう。I see. In this way I find another path. And there's the dude. Wait, what is it since gonna do? Point left. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> so just your imagination, don't worry about it. Uh, and then I guess I could use this. Here we go. Easy. Don't worry about it. You did a great job, Chingy. Nice. One more. It's probably just one more puzzle and then I'll be able to uh, finish this quest. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm getting a little bit lost here. 
Where does this lead? Okay, I do need to go down here so I can grab all these things. Now I head back up. Not this one. There we go. Okay, now I head down. Still don't know how to grab this though. Oh, I see how. Yep. Oh wait, I should have gone down here. Ah, taking the long way around. Are you sure about that? Ooh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you can't let him die. Right, continue. Finish up the quest. Can I just do this? Oh, no attack, Santo. I wonder how I can use this. I'm not sure. Oh, I found out how to use them now. All right, never mind. Oh, it actually got to me? But now I know how to use her. Oh, her counter is way too quick. Oh, the second attack, I didn't expect it. Sheesh! That's some damage. It probably won't end well this time. Yeah, it won't. See you later, loser. Oh. Hey! She actually does have moves. Hmm. He won't listen until we hit him. Oh. Uh, Shinji just to still hit him, just in case. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we didn't exactly come here to rescue you, so...
武士が必要に EMP を使わねば無駄に戦う必要もなかった<笑>まその通りだがなぜインを踏んだあ、uh, she's old don't worry about it <笑>新エリートの現行放棄に戻す気危険な武器の不法所持及び故意に他人の身体や財産の安全を侵害しようとした罪であなたを逮捕しますジャスティスサーあなたの名前はカルロモロンだご協力に感謝しますモロンさんあなたには目視権がありますフォローを出た後あなたは弁護士に連絡するか高専弁護人協会の支援を受けることができます Still don't know why he even did all those things like he didn't even he's hasn't stolen anything He didn't do anything to the ducks. He didn't do anything to the bang boo. He didn't do anything to the old woman. Uh, what else happened? He didn't do anything to the car, the bang boo car. And he didn't do anything. He just like EMP'd a random car and the car lost control. It almost hit Bell, but that's like another thing. Like it wasn't like expected. She was like walking over from like an alleyway. There was no way that he would have known that she was just gonna pop out from the alleyway. So why? Why is he using the MP? Is he just having some fun? Just playing around with it? Hehe. <laughs> Nice perception check. Makes me wonder if he knows, if she fully knows. And it's over. There we go. Complete. I said complete. Okay, there we go. That was close. Shinji's intuition is sharper than we thought. She actually sensed you were nearby. Lucky she didn't try to get dig deeper. Anyway, the culprit was caught. We can finally relax now. Wise, Shinji and Sujan are about to report back to the uh, about the arrest. Wait, probably talk to the driver and give change first. Let's head over and check it out. <laughs> Gotta do this quick, as fast as possible. Uh, Officer Mew Mew. So apparently there should be one more quest after this, or like one more commission. After I finish it, I... Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Should be out of the intermission. And after that, I'm safe. Now I can do the uh, the events and end stream. But I don't have much time left. Which really sucks. シュウさん、チンイ、お帰り。その様子だと犯人はもう捕まったみたいだね。ええ。彼は局に連行して初歩的な取り調べも終わったところです。よし。もうすぐ戻る。その犯人、この辺りで事件を起こした動機は何だった
犯人はどうやってそんなものを手に入れたの犯人はとあるホロ,ホロレイダーギャング。供述によるとこの組織は EMP 発生装置を違法に製造し、うん、車のセキュリティに特化した改造を施していたとのことでした。その強盗団だけで完結することなのか少し気になるところではあるな<笑>我らもそう思っておるゆえ犯人にはもう一度しっかり取り調べを受けてもらわねばなうう I'm getting sleepy Those three hours of sleep that I had last night are just not helping ただこれ以上は調査の内容を公にできぬそこは分かってくれるであろう<笑>まあ、事件の状況はこんなところです。私たちもこれから取り調べに参加するので、今日はもう戻ります。シュンガンのジョーザン方、待ってくれ。チョップ大将、事件について、他にも聞いておきたいことがありますかいやいや、その辺はもうきっちり教えてもらった。実は、俺と近所の連中から。お前さんたちに言いたいことがあるんだ。治安官のお二方、今日はお釣りの疑いを晴らしていただいたばかりか、犯人が今後もたらすであろう被害の目も積んでくださったこと、誠にありがとうございました。今朝の比例についてもお詫びさせてください。先ほど近所の皆さんと相談して、治安局が土曜日に開催するという交渉は参加することで一致しました。これは私たちが記入したアンケートですえ本当ですかああ俺たち住民の防犯意識を高めるってんだろみんなで聞きに行くのも悪かねえそれに聞いたんだジョーちゃんたちがここでイベントの準備をしてんのはブリンガーの野郎の命令なんだろ俺たちがあいつに不満があるからってお前さんたちできる治安官のお仕事を邪魔しちゃうさすがに道理が通らねえもんよ過分なお言葉です市民の安全を守るのは私たちの責務ですからでも皆さんが講習に参加してくれるのならそれはとても助かります治安官さん俺にもアンケートをくれねえか俺もそいつに参加させてくれよかったどうにか全部丸く収まったねふんふんこれすなわち無心で枝さす柳計らずも木陰をなす I mean, it, so many things happened today. It's getting late. I should hurry back and get some sleep. Still, one more quest to be done. Uh, so, I should hurry up and do it. Hurry up and go to Eep. There we go. Warm bed. I was only thinking of saying hi to Suja and the others today. I didn't expect that I would end up so busy today. I should go to bed now. Hmm. Still back in him? I was at Luminous Square waiting for a friend today and I saw a bunch of posters bring, uh, with Bringer's face on them. Pretty sure they were promoting some public security event. Not gonna lie, at first glance, I totally thought it was part of Bringer's campaign. What's different take on this? You guys backing him to be, uh, to be the next chief of the Janus Quarters public security? Plebs? Damn, son. Hmm. I'm pretty tired today. Sujan and Shinji. They finally don't need to worry about the lecture now. The lecture. Bringer. The campaign. You rest, in, you rest comfortably. Now your mind feels exceptionally clear. Dear citizen, greetings from your super uh, friendly neighbor and trusted Paul officer Mew Mew. Uh, you forgot? It's a template, of course. We're about to change the greeting template and accidentally sent it out. Purr. You forgive Lolly Mew Mew, right? Meow. What's with that meow? 
Hey, anyway, the Good Neighbors uh, Community Celebration at Luminous Square has started. And guess who's in charge? Yeah, it's me, your kind and friendly neighbor, Officer Mew Mew. I'm sending this message to invite you to join the celebration. Feel free to pay me a visit at Luminous Square. Happy. Okay. What's the next thing that I have to do? Mew Mew on, on uh, Luminous Square. Uh, right here. Yeah, it's probably just like shadow people here that are causing the, uh, the lag, like the performance issues in the game, in the Nomina Square. There you are, my good citizen friend. What? Celebration, you say? Well, unfortunately, the celebration's already over, but no worries, as I prepare a more pleasant surprise for you. Care, care to take a while guess what it is? What can it be? You got it! It's a fantastic opportunity to lend in a helping hand. Now, isn't that an awesome surprise? Walks away. Oh, hey! Don't go away, good citizen! I, Officer Mew Mew, will reward you with this good citizen medal, just like always. It's just to lend a hand to the citizens to make new edit to a better place. All while getting limited edition good citizen medal from Officer Mew Mew, don't you think? So, who needs my help this time? Well, I have to admit it feels a little awkward to ask a good citizen like you to help us. I mean, we the public security officers are meant to help you, not the other way around. But honestly, one of our officers uh, does need your help this time. To be more precise, it's a bank with, who works as an assistant in our office. You've been a real champ in dealing with bank boo issues on 6th Street. So naturally, you were the first person I thought of. The task this time, simply put, we need to help my bank boo companion find a new job. Eh? Do bank boos get fired too? Fired? No, quite the contrary. That bank boo is a real wit. His performance is so outstanding that everybody wants him to stay. But here's the twist. He's got his own ideas. Two days ago, he came to me and... And not... I might not want to be a security officer anymore, Mew Mew. We had officers leave before, but this is the first time bank boo has asked for a career change. This gives everyone in the bank boo management department a headache. And my colleague himself is struggling too. So I really need your help with this one, good citizen. Sure, I'll go have a chat with him. You're definitely the most dependable citizen in new attitude. The security boo, who needs help, is right in this neighborhood. Please go and uh, please go to him and ask him for details. Okay. I'll head on over. Cause I gotta do this quick. Seriously, I want to eat more. Also tired. KK. Gosh, that's got the cat scratched my eyes again. Can I help with anything? Greetings, good citizen. I'm security boo number 7406. Please feel free to call me KK. How can I assist? Officer Mimi sent you here to help me find a new job. Seriously, I can't stand this job anymore. I'm all ears. Isn't it unfair that my responsibilities were predetermined at the, from the very moment that I was created just because I'm a special model? I'm sick and tired of being a security boo, dealing with, with petty neighborhood issues all day long. When I was dealing with a traffic accident yesterday, an angry driver kicked me in the butt, and I still have those shoe prints back there. Well, violent. Just now when I climbed the tree, uh, climbed out to the tree to save a cat, the pesky cat scratched my lens and ruined my freshly painted case. And don't even get me started on kids throwing things at me while on patrol. Or dealing with line cutters or getting shoved around by troublemakers. The officers get all the glory and medals while us, us bank boo do all the grunt work. So you're considering a career change? Yeah, by keeping a security boo sooner or later, my AI core will go haywire. That's why I made my uh, made up my mind to find a way out. Once I get myself a new job, I'm handing my resignation in the letter. Officer Mew Mew mentioned a bank boo employment expert who runs a video store and has a wide range of connections in all industries. That must be you, right? Truth is, I barely know anything about other industries. That's why I was hoping you could help me out by giving me a referral to, referral to for a new job. Officer Mew Mew has contacted two store managers at Luminous Square, and I can go there for an interview whenever I'm ready. Please and thank you. No problem, KK. Let's go. Complete the commission, it's hard to find a job. It's hard to be a bank boo. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to do this. I'm forced to. Hello, little one. You must be KK, the one Mew Mew mentioned. Looking for work, right? This picture of attending KK bustling among the bouquets is pretty cute. But running a flower shop takes more than just looking cute. I'm ready. KK is ready. I need to try to recommend some seasonal flowers to this potential customer over here. Actually, I haven't had a chance to download any horticultural data yet. That's okay, caring and communicating with a customer is as important as understanding a nursery plant. Why not rely on your own experience and help this he uh, hesitant customer make up his mind? Negative work is my uh, strong suit. Let me see. 
The suspect? No. I mean the customer style and vibe. I've got it. Hello, dear customer. Um, hello, do you have any flower recommendations? First, may I ask what's the purpose of your purpose purchase? Mm, it's for someone important to me. Oh, are they a gentleman or a lady? It, it's for a lady. Mmm, I knew it. Look at you. You can barely take care of yourself, let alone flowers. What? How you? How could you talk to a customer like that? Do they really look that bad? It's for a girl you like uh, at school, isn't it? Kids nowadays, you're all the same. It's my mom's birthday and I'm here to buy her some flowers. Manager, I want to speak with your manager. I'm going to file a complaint. And it's Jover. Orkidia goes to great lengths to explain the situation to the customer and offers a bouquet as an apology. Lesson learned. I can't have trainees work with customers directly anymore. Forget about the cost of the bouquet. What, did, uh, what you did could have really damaged you Gardening's reputation. And you, you referred KK, didn't you? I'm really sorry. My apologies. It's fine. The interview was my idea, but I'm sorry. I cannot hire this bank boo. Security boo, uh, security boo KK's first time that the job market has been declared a failure. I unconsciously used interrogation techniques just now. I do have some understanding of friendly communication with citizens, but because of my personality, this uh, those acts are usually handled by my human partner. Mm, your communication skills can really use some work. Alright, next one. Old Dewey. Speak to the bamboo, I've been waiting for you. This little guy must be the bamboo for the interview, right? Of uh, Officer Mew Mew said you're quite a talented security boo. Officer Mew Mew said that? Hmm, <clears throat> that's quite a compliment. We've been short staffed lately, and I happen to be in the need of a an apprentice masseur. I was wondering if you would be interested. It's not what I was expecting, but uh, I was not expecting this to be a massage place either. But I'd like to give it a shot. I can do it. Hey, this little guy has so much energy. It reminds me of my younger days when I was an apprentice masseur myself. Listen up, I've got an important requirement talent. My master always says talent was crucial when it comes to learning the 72 arts of massage. Alright, little guy, I show you a few moves and then you can give it a try on me. Are you sure? Please prepare yourself. Everyone says I've got some really strong hands. No worries, my shell is built on an industrial class hardness. I'll do his hands, or to, be more or to be more precise, his six hands wave in the air. Shirking a few fancy poses, KK follows along, leaving a few noticeable dents on old Dewey's shell. You got some serious strength in those hands, little guy. A public security power monitor, little packs of punch. Thinking about being protected by such a powerful security boot once my AI core and makes me forget the pain. <laughs> huh. I'm sorry, I guess my 18 grappling arts of the law reflex kicked in, and I didn't expect it to work so differently from your, your massage techniques. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> well, no worries, it's just a few dents. My ultra high strength metal shell can handle it just fine. But if it were a customer, well, maybe they wouldn't have survived. I'm sorry, Mr. Doogie. I guess I understand uh, how this interview is going to turn out. Let me get you down, little guy. If you change your power unit and hand components, you might still be uh you might still have a chance. And I have to say, your 18 grappling arts of the law was pretty impressive. Alright, what do we do now, KK? In your opinion, do I really have any other talent other than me at Security Boo? There are many other jobs out there. You're right, perhaps I just have a talent for the service industry, so maybe I shouldn't limit my job to search to Luminous Square. Or else can I find a job that's more technical and doesn't have to interact with customers directly? Ever thought about construction site? Construction site? Bellabock Industries, that's a famous company, right? I had no idea you had connections like that. You must be a master at networking. Actions lead to success. Let's get going now. I'll be there as soon as I finish up here. See you at the site. Out we go. Alright. Uh, who should I talk to? I'm gonna guess Lee? Right on time, dear manager. If I remember correctly, you know a lot about bamboo technology, right? Am I really that famous? No time to explain now. It's an urgent matter involved with that bamboo's life. Please just go and check uh, check it out. Where should I go? Up there. The midway platform at the construction site. A builder boo, but if you're of heights, passed out up there. Please go up and check it out. It's just that nobody knows how to fix a bamboo here. I think I'm the only one here who can fix bamboo. Then why are you still here? 
Well, because I'm afraid of heights too. If I go up there and pass out, things will get pretty messy. Yeah, I can guess that getting you down is going to be really tough, Mr. Bear. Some of my colleagues have already gone out to check on that bank book. Could you please go there and see what's going on? Uh, I'm going to guess that this wasn't the mission. Uh, how can I change the mission that I'm doing? Through this, maybe? It's hard to find a job. This one. Start tracking. Oh, is it really this? I guess so. Uh, poor little bamboo. There you are, manager. Something is not good with this bamboo. I did a quick check and it seems to be due to a flaw in the outdated space awareness al algorithm. The stress reaction uh, triggered a power fa failure in certain modules, which in turn caused a system flare. What do you think, manager? I'm not entirely sure what you're saying, but it doesn't sound good. Any ideas, manager? Bro, wake up! Bro! I've applied a simple physical uh, block, but without further intervention, prolonged power off could cause permanent damage to its storage unit. What? Don't forget about me, bro. Leave it to me. I got this. Should be like this, 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 this. And there we go. <laughs> Bamboos are so bouncy. Even when it was sticking on the ground, it was still cute and bouncing around. <sighs> Whoa, stretch. <laughs> what happened? I was up there and then I blanked out. I passed out because of heights, but we managed to get there in time and saved you. Oh, it's coming back to me now. Thank you, kind-hearted manager and handsome security boo. Why handsome for KK and kind hard for me? But let's just head down before it shuts down again. Hmm. I'm stuck. Uh, what time is it? I don't think I'm gonna be able to finish. I'm afraid I'm not going to be able to finish. Thanks for helping me today. I forgot. I'm just going to let you guys read.
There we go. Finish with my food. That was pretty fast. Oh, there's gonna be the sage in the trash can. Or trash can sage. I can't remember what it's called. Wait, I'll check it out later. It really is a lot of people. General shop, there's Tin Master. Ah, <gasps> oh, it's not the person that I thought it was. She's cute though. I like her ribbons. Natalie and Summer. Natalie, post security seems to have having an event. How about we skip past that day and come here for an air? If the school is just to enjoy the AC, we could go to a team milk shop shop. But don't you think it's thrilling to be an outlaw hiding in the public security office? I know exactly how you feel. <laughs> Guardian. Sujan and Ching Chi. The public security officer that's uh like kinda laid back. Oh, it's Fisher and Charlotte. And another security boo. I think both of these guys are the ones that are on 6th Street. This guy's really afraid of the dark. So she always goes with him. I don't think it's her. I think this is another person. It might be another person. Hmm. Anyways. <laughs> it too seems to be in a good mood. ご <laughs> 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 This is probably going to be really nervous. <clears throat> <laughs> hmm. Everything's ready? Everything's Oops. Ooh, there we go. Analyze and locate the exact coordinates of the places my room previously identified inside the hollow. Let's take a look at this. Oops. Okay, so it's like a little secret thing or something. That might be the quest that I need to do. <laughs> Investigating those areas with them. Hmm? Stretch. Oh, I'm feeling so lazy. What's wrong? Suyan and Shinji walk away looking serious. Mm -hmm. I wonder. Oh, damn. I cannot talk to them. Where are they? Just behind the wall? Yep. What? Over here. This is here is perfectly blocked off by the wall. Nobody will notice us. Shh. Listen, I think Sujan and Jindy are talking about what happened. On the pad outside of public security. Senpai, 
Oh, right, 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 right. The unidentified uh, ethereal. Oops. Mm. If by some chance the dogs have the power of the same ethereal to affect electronics, then it could be really bad. Evidence carrier. <gasps> they're trying to take the body. That's what they're trying to do. うん。車両の but they're actually just going for the body. Mmm, So it's possible that they already got to it. Is it raining? I don't think it's raining yet, but I can see the clouds. Oh, and the birds are going ham as well. And it's probably gonna rain soon. There's no time. We have to get there now. That's what she's gonna say. Oh. Hmm. Hmm.故に自動輸送車が襲撃されたコンキョはないのだぞ。この段階で報告したところで、局は人を起こしたりせん。she does want to go there. But she's pretty much thinking about all the possibilities first. Hmm? Hmm?例の怪物の回収は日時が決まって間もないこと。ましてやホロー内の走行ルートなぞ。so there's someone leaking secrets. Lincoln? Leaking. だがモロンによれば、奴の所属する組織はある程度時間をかけてフォローを下にしていたというではないか。つまり、治安局が内通者がいるかもしれないと。最後 mm -hmm. Wasn't Solar Eleven's story about there being a mole? Is it about... Are they both of them connected? Wait, 
大変な準備を費やした上、メディアも大勢詰めかけておる。主にとっても、グリンガー長官に良いところを見せる、得難い機会。Ah, but it's very difficult. But it's very difficult for Shinji to just go by herself because she's a robot, and the EMPs affect her. So if they have the scale of the EMP that、uh, Carlo was using was probably a, a weak one. They might have a stronger one to actually deal with the car and everything else instead of like the hollow. And that one might actually incapacitate Shingi. うん。だつ。うん。終焉は後は任せた。ではな。祭るべく泣きを祭るは手伝いである。Ah,、uh, failure to act when action is needed shows a lack of courage, so she's gonna go. Senpai,言ってたことですよ。大事なのは私たちが治安官として何をすべきかを知っていることだと。確かに私は長官の影響でこの仕事を選びました。ですがそれは彼への恩返しでも褒めてもらうためでもありません。あの時の長官と同じ。誰かを守れる人間になりたい。それだけです。Well <笑> And he wouldn't mind it. That's true. Before we just wanted to help them, but now there's even some, there's something bigger at risk here. They're both well trained officers, but the two of them alone still aren't enough for this investigation. Plus, that evidence is crucial for us. It's also crucial for us. We can't risk it falling into the wrong hands. Wise, let's head home, connect to the HDD system, and help them out in the hollow. Confirm. A perilous duty. I think that's the last one. HDD, HDD. What do you have to say, Irin? Wise. Sujon and Shinji should be in the hall by now. We should get moving too.、Mm. Alright, Perlo's duty. Let's go. Let's finish this fast. I have to. So I'm getting more and more tired. I'm running more、uh, out of time. Possible I want to sleep at the very least 30 minutes. Maybe even an hour. Take a quick nap. ジュエンよ。我らの推測に照らせば犯人はすでに証拠品を持ち出しておるはず。いかにして奪還すべきか良い考えはあるか。ウェビッドシラダデン。はい、先輩。思ったんですが、犯人が治安局に異変を悟られ
お兄ちゃん、シュエンさんとチンイは先に自動輸送車を探しに行くみたい。うん。フェアリー、車両の場所まで行ける近道とかないかい。車両。I wonder if that's Katakana. Oh, right. I should probably do this. My phone moved a little bit a second ago. And I should probably calibrate again. There we go. I'm gonna guess that I'm gonna have to move them by using this. Yeah. There we go. This one needs to move up. There we go. And this one needs to move down. Ah, it's do it three times. Here we go. Don't think about it, I'm helping you. Haha. <laughs> We're good, guys. Let's go have a look. Since we didn't deal with Ethereum, they probably won't notice EOS. Right? <laughs> I like that little look that she gives you. And the little cape, the little Neps cape. It's also pretty cute. And she looks really nice. Damn! This little thing killed them by itself. Thing's strong, or the enemies are weak, one or the other. ましたこれが自動輸送車です先輩すぐに車両の状況を確認しましょう外観は異常なし何かが破壊された痕跡も Shinji uses the key to unlock the carrier. Hmm? Wait, but is it still inside? Yep. Yep. They took it and sealed it again. やっぱり犯人はすでに証拠品を持ち去っていましたか。うんうん。そうではないと見せかけるためにわざわざこんなものまで用意して盗むだけではなく、ハンドのメモを欺こうとしていたみたいですね。あの怪物にはどうやら人
So much damage. Nice. I tried to use the dodge because he usually that punch attack. It's a yellow dodge. That deals so much wah, damage. Please die. There we go. I didn't want to use my ult because it probably is more to the fight, like to the level. Oh, it starts to rain. Wait, since they have a mo Did somebody see them leave? Oh gosh, what if it's... I already forgot his name, but the officer. The uh, deputy commissioner? What if he's the one that's actually the mole? Huh. But he didn't see them leave, right? The one in the wrong workshop? <laughs> Can we do something? Hmm. Hmm. Find a way to warn them. I think it's better to just divert them. Hmm. They don't know where to go either. To find the body? Oh, cutscene? Nope. Hmm. They're throwing a lot at them to actually stop them. I wonder what's going on. Ooh. They're doing a lot, and I mean a lot. They have like a full army. That's a nice smile. Caution, the enemy is detected.
Perfect. I don't know if they like clear all of them, but I actually got all my bullets back. Which is nice. I think I'm gonna do this early instead of doing all the attacks. Right, this should finish it off. There has to be a way. There's always a way. We're the main characters after all. Unstable special fissures. Good question, because we cannot show up in front of them. Oh! Well, why didn't you tell us that sooner, Fairy? I'm sure Fairy has a way to camouflage us. Hey, it doesn't expose us as being wise and bell, it exposes us as being a proxy. Just like a proxy helping them. They just won't know who the proxy is. Both? ですが、they're nice people, right? They'll turn a blind eye, right? Mm. Failure to act when action is needed shows a lack of courage. They'll turn a blind eye, right? Surely. ちょ、シュアリー。シュエンさんとチンイはいい人だ。ペイント。僕たちの将来背負うかもしれないリスクなんかより。今手をこまないでいたせいで、生涯悔やみ続けることになる方を僕は恐れる。あ、イッツ、
Serbot with me right now. And pew. Oh, wait. Oh, I only deleted it. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Can she really be installed into another body? I wonder. Hmm. Yeah, and this is how they get stuck for like a gazillion years trying to just like say, no, you, no, you, no, you, no, you, you want cards all over the place. <laughs> nice, nice entry. It doesn't matter. I'm here to help you. どうして我らが主の言うことを信じられるか <laughs> She's smart. Oh. Nice. That is pretty scary. Ooh. What the hell? <laughs> and they know me. I'm sure they remember Eus. Eus. Also, I do remember seeing like a little animation that somebody did uh, of Sujan and Shinji just like uh, jumping off of like ledges and stuff like that, or like off of like a a cliff multiple times, and there being like, well, let's just say a lot of danger at the bottom, but there be like uh, there always be like a special uh, special fissure for them to actually just like teleport away and now I see the context of it it was like that animation that animation was the context for that meme video no one important ah. <laughs> the one at the top of the uh, the wanted list, yes, that that's me. <laughs> 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 
Not really. It was a uh, a bit of a coincidence, but uh, you know, things happen. そうだ。あの日僕はホロウで白木重工がなくしたものを探すのを手伝ってた。でもその奥で思いがけずあの怪物に出くわしたんだ。うん。君たちと同じように僕もあの怪物には裏があると思った。あれの背後に隠された陰
So the EMP was used. So the Trojan's devices show no signs of external damage, but many internal components have been burned out. So must be the... Yep, the EMP. Uh, can I go around this? No, I need to do the transmission. Class bamboo? Is it because he got hit by the EMP? Judging by the bamboo's condition, it has been affected by the EMP and the carrot it was carrying was, is also damaged. The word big head is on the bamboo's outfit and it has clearly been illegally modified. Mm. Okay, just head through here I guess. What am I spinning? Ah, I see. Um, I'm supposed to go over here? Oh, I can't. Because of the walls. I see, I see, I see, I see. There we go. And now I use this. Is it only towards the right? I think it's only towards the right. Because there's nothing down here. And now I can get up here. Perfect. This should be the last clue, right? Was this used to move the car? Or something? This is not a construction zone within the hollow, yet the forklift is parked here. Where did this vehicle come from and where is it, go uh, where is it going? to the driver's compartment to investigate. After the rule investigation of the driver's compartment, it's found that the vehicle can no longer be started due to an electronic system failure. Our driving records seem to be intact. Carefully examine the, work, uh, the forklift. The forklift surface lacks an anti-corruption coating, indicating that it's not a model used within the hollow, but there are no signs of corruption on the vehicle. Hmm. Although the driving record data is encrypted, with ferry here, there is no problem. Right? Decrypt. Oh, there, we, there it is, the Big Head's carrier uh, data, and we know what the Big Head is now. The recording seems to involve the culprits who targeted the evidence carrier, indicating they didn't follow their leader's instructions. Alright, time to head back to the uh, Mindscape. I think I got all the clues, yep. There's a heavy car toolbox up at the scene and an uncorrupted forklift was found. From this we can draw the conclusion. Yes, they were parachuting. <laughs> I probably should have chosen another one just to see what they say. Okay. 
The foreglaze nearby is rendered inoperable by EMP effects, and there are some hard to identify footprints around the scene which may enter. take off into the sky. <laughs> I'm sorry, Suyan. <laughs> I wonder if she was about to laugh, or she's just like, <laughs> just uh, she just held in the the face of disgust after that. Right. Last question. A severely damaged, illegally modified bangui was found near the scene, and the Com and combining this with the content of the recording, some deductions can be made. Mine! <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's passing by. Alright. Right. What is this? Combining all clues and deductions collected, it's possible to hypothesize. Hypothesize. It's probably just not far from here. Mm-hmm. Next to the evidence carrier. Mm -hmm. And the right answer. Start the case replay. Mm -hmm. And boom, they use the EMP immediately and hit the bangu. Mm -hmm. We're currently in the middle of a cage replay. The replay will pause after a clip finishes playing. When a clip is paused, you are free to explore as you please. Press the highlighted area to watch the entire clip. To move on to the next clip, please, please press continue. Uh, I guess press continue. An orange clip indicates an impor important clues within. Please explore your surroundings. Looking closely, there seems to be a hidden pad ahead. The heavy object that created it should be up ahead. Keep an eye out for this place to return into reality. Keep investigating. Once you have investigated the uh, the key clues, the clip will become blue. The clip has been investigated. Press continue to go to the next clip. Guess so. Hmm. 
ちは何やら小さな扉の前でひそひそ話をしています。Ah,、uh, yes, and please tell me the password in a very loud voice. <laughs> Pain. <laughs> Investigate it further. Once you have investigated all the important clips, you may head back to reality. Press exit to end the case replay. There we go. Out they go. No need. Alright, first off. Yeah, but I still need that thing here. Also, there should be more to the,、uh, to the level because I only have one of these. Oops. There we go. Now I head down here. And down here. Six, five, five, three, six. Alright. There's no special dialogue. So, might as well just grab the,、uh, the correct one now. Uh... Yeah, there's a lot over here, too. Right. Case fall time. Alright, what's it gonna be? And where's the extra stuff? Because I still need one more after this one. <laughs> Left, right, up. Okay. Oh, that's nice. Heck shit. And up. Is she? Oh, there's just one more. And I need to find on in which one they are in.、Uh, Where's it? Right here. But I still don't have the last one. I'm scared of that one. Just missing it. Read the data. So, yeah, this one has Denny's. This one has the thing that I'm missing, and that's about it. How do I just mark it? There we go. Simple enough. No need. There we go. The last one, and now the last fight. Hello! 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 Hello!
I thought it was gonna be just two of them. Oh, this is probably gonna stack them. It's gonna kill. And that was good. That almost hit me. Which is very simple to use. I thought it'd be a little bit more difficult because I thought it was gonna have more weapons. deals way more damage than me for some reason <laughs> Allow me. ちょっと<笑> <laughs> now this is a good senpai. <laughs> oh, that's also nice. That's true, we don't take any bad jobs, we don't help any bad guys. Maybe Nicole, but uh, she's special. <laughs> It's fine, it's fine, it's off the record! <laughs> so I'm almost done with the intermission, I'm gonna turn off the AC. It's gonna be subbing the stream soon. The bank boo walks away and soon disappears from sight. Uh, oops. 
<clears throat> we were watching you from the start. <clears throat> no, we're totally not the siblings that you encountered. <clears throat> mm. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, mm. no, mm. <clears throat> mm. Uh, we're we're special. We uh, logic doesn't bind us. Mm -hmm. Ah. <laughs> You wouldn't be burning any bridges, right? That's that's what you said. I'm sure, it'll be fine, right? Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> A few days later. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if they're just gonna. I'm gonna arrive there, and when I'm about to leave, they're just gonna say thank you for everything, Python. Yeah. We'll just be like, oh. Eh, どうしてまた治安局なんだい？実は今日ね、周遠さんとチーン二人が元の局に戻る日らしいの。So でも、フォローの外ってなったら、会いたくても簡単には会えなくなるかもでしょ。シュルムはリスケットにとゲットアメンバーチャーカード。一理あった。せめて二人の連絡先ぐらいは手に入れたいところだ。あ、<笑><
Yeah. Something like that has to happen, right? Uh, <laughs>。ついでに、この辺をブラブラして、この間からの悲願になってる。美味しいご飯を食べないと。Of course Bell wouldn't forget about wouldn't uh, Of course Bell would not forget about that. That is very important food. Alright, what are they gonna say to each other now, though? Everything is a poem. ん今日は忙しくないのあ、みやび。今仕方、我らの卒業アルバムを眺めていてね。へえ、that's <笑> Oh, as practice? Or does she have like a little cute side? <laughs> How edgy. Hmm. That's a good question. Since true justice is probably more subjective rather than regular just justice, which is like the average. <笑>私の顔メロンはありがとう。<笑> Maybe a friend told her? Oh, was it changed from them to section 6? Oh, oh. あの証拠品があなたたちのところにやっぱり何かあったのね。うん。a mask. Human DNA. <laughs> right, it did have like an electronic mask. Was it core? Did cores become the monster? If it didn't, if she didn't find a match, and course is still probably in the criminals, or maybe even missing person on uh, records. Hmm. Hmm. Somebody wanted that body bad. 
同感だだが今のところこの謎を解く鍵は見つかっていない情報ありがとう宮部また近いうちにあそれでは<笑>すみません先輩お待たせしました今し方の電話ダンピンから察するにハンドの方で調べていた証拠品の件進展があったのであろう Hasn't to see like an interaction between her and Miyabi was kind of cute. Especially because they're supposed to be like very old friends and they graduated together. That night, in a certain meeting room in the Janus Quarters Public Security Bill, Perlman. Oh, it's this dude. I already have forgotten about this guy's name. It has to be the person that's uh, that was like controlling Vision Corp from the shadows. Yep, Sara. This is really cute. <laughs> Not gonna lie. <laughs> Technical advisor and personal secretary. So, how could you be able to do that? She's coming in. Gonna try and take him out again? Help him? Oh. Oh. Mm, they're gonna use him as a scapegoat. And that bastard behind you. Hmm. I'm gonna guess that the other option is death. Hey, I, they were trying to remove They were trying to get rid of the evidence of it Probably Oh, take the evidence and remove Any trace of there being something there うん。私が握っているといったらどうする。貴様とその背後にいる奴がビジョンの爆破未遂に1枚噛んでいたと証明できる。絶対的な証拠。Looks like this guy is going to get silent soon. ヒデタカシ。しつこい男は嫌いだけど。誰の切り札は本物と言わざるを得ないわ。あの死んでいるような口ぶりだな。うん。オーナーファンツポストノーヒズボイス。私は真剣に私たちの協力関係を心配してる
two completely different things. Think too logically, you'll lose all the joy in life. Okay, okay, I just can't win with you, can I? Oh yeah, remember to buy a few extra copies of Mission Unthinkable next time you get it to get it stuck in. Oh, it's already late. You should get ready for bed. Going back to my room now. Good night. Night night. They're lying down on the soft bed, my legs, tired from so much walking, suddenly relaxed. I never thought that we would become friends with public security officers. Public security no longer has the evidence. Hopefully the bad guys will no longer target Su Yang and Ching Ying. Ching Yi. But clues. Are there other clues? Before you know it, you drift into a deep slumber. You sleep so soundly and your body feels completely recovered. I don't think there will be any public security business today. Let's see what's on the schedule. Maybe I can take it easy today. Grace Agent Sorry, the Iron Witch, has been recorded. The schedule has been updated. And recent commission log have been recorded in the video archive. And mission friendship supervision in progress. No idea what this means. Maybe if I bring up the internet and the schedule. Friendship. Friendship supervision. Yeah. Okay. There it is. Ah, finally. So the only thing that I fear is that uh, it's going to do arrange today's schedule. Yeah. Eh. There is a chance that I'm going to end the day and it's going to lock me on something. Um... Some sort of like story. That's the only thing that I fear. But anyways, finish chapter two intermission. It lasted quite a bit longer than it should have. You know, it was supposed to be just two hours, and I'm here at four hours. But it was still fun. I even got to eat. I did eat while the mic off though. <laughs> That's fine. But anyways, for anybody that came over, Leviathan that came over and said hi. Thank you. Juliet also that you came in hi. Thank you. And for now, I'm just gonna, you know, head out. Let me see something. Yep. All right. For anybody that came by, I'll probably be back next week. Nothing tomorrow because tomorrow is like my big, big, big free day. And it's the time where I actually just catch up with all the weeklies that I need to do and all the gacha games. And I'm going to have to catch up a lot with this game because there's a lot of quests that I still need to do. And I still need to do all the events as well. And there's Arknight farming and then there's Honky farming, blah, 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 blah. Oh, there's so much to do. But anyways, for anybody that came by, for anybody that logged by, for anybody that said hi, thank you for watching. And see you next time. Mwah, mwah.